Hi everyone. Hi. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back. Daniel, please. No. <laughs> anyway, hi everybody. We're gonna play The Sims 4 today, shockingly. I'm also like three minutes early, but I was sitting here and I was like, I might as well stream. I don't know. If we're here, then we're here. <laughs> so let me move this paper. Okay. I'm ready to game. I hope that you are too. I know it's been a weird week for the streams. I apologize. This, uh, there's a lot going on, <laughs> but I feel like we're over the bridge now. Everything's handled. Um, there's just been a lot going on recently. So, oh, and yesterday, yesterday I had a little anxiety attack in the post office parking lot and then it started storming very badly. So I did not go live. <laughs> Because by the time I had returned, I was not doing good. <laughs> so, <laughs> anyway, um, I'll tell you about that later. It's fine. Happens to the best of us. Felony Moose, hi. Thank you for the 19 months, by the way. Um, so what we're do gonna you want? Wait, no. Nope. What do you That's want? That's the break scene. No, this is what I wanted to open. Because we're gonna play some of the Potts family today. Um, because it's been like a week. We built the house and we haven't gotten to play yet. And we're starting like the next generation. So um, this will be pretty fun because we're going to actually get to start playing with Jackie now. Um, oh my god, wrong sim, wrong sim, wrong sim. Wait, come back. You? You? Oh, you put Snappy's toy in here? What are, are you going to close my door or yours? I was going to crack your door. Oh, then she can get it still. Yeah. Anyway, so the Potts family. Um, as you can see, we're starting the sixth generation. As soon as Jackie has kids, that'll be the seventh generation. <laughs> My cat got a new toy today. Um, and I didn't want him to close the door so that, cause I wanted her to have access to it. <laughs> um, anyway, as soon as Jackie has kids, we'll be on gen seven, which is so weird. Um, Jackie has like a kind of girlfriend. I don't think her and Polly are officially dating, but they've been flirting. You know, <laughs> I don't think they made it official yet, but we've definitely been like talking to Polly, you know? Um, so I think that's the plan. Um, I think we'll marry Polly, but I don't know. We'll see. We could change our mind. You never know what'll happen. <laughs> um, Dan, Jade, Ayo, it's Joe, Harley, Pocket, Crows, Eclipse, Emma, Bumble, Tilly, Keithy, Ebarn, Catherine, Maddie with the 24 months, Night Owl, Smitty, Tegan, um, Amelia, Medusa, Moist, Socks, ooh, <laughs> Jen Lynn. Um, everybody, thank you for the subs. Uh, Miss Kim as well, thank you so much. Um, there's a million tombstones. Oh yeah, well, I'm on the sixth generation of this family, so, you know, some of these people died of old age and stuff. Um, some. <laughs> uh, <laughs> So, anyway, <laughs> anyway, <laughs> just watch my YouTube videos? Nice! Welcome to the stream, though. It's good to see you. Um, okay, so, today, like I said, we just built- Whoa, Space Kitten just gifted 25 subs? Hello? Space Kitten, thank you so much for the massive sub gift. <laughs> Hello? I really, really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, and happy alpaca. Thank you for the- wait. That's close enough. Thank you for the bits. It says Applaca. But I, I assume it is meant to say alpaca. And it was just taken. I don't know. Elizabeth, Worst, Kelby, Emily, <laughs> Mama Sim, uh, Garrett, Beth, thank you all for the subs, too. <laughs> yeah, look, a couple of these people I did not kill, okay? For example, um, oh no. Yes, this one simply died at the bar when I was there, and I took her gravestone and brought it home with me so that she wouldn't have to be on her own. Why are my sims always poor? Well, um, they're not. I just built a new house, and I spent all of my money on it. So right now we only have 200 simoleons, but that's just because I, I literally built this the last time I played this save, and I spent, like, almost every last dime. Um... So I want, cause I wanted to get like some nice stuff for the new house. So we'll slowly add to this. Um, I, I find the Sims is like not that fun when you have too much money. I don't know if you agree with me or not, but like I find it's really boring once your Sims have like 30,000 simoleons in the bank and like you don't need to worry about bills anymore. Like I think that's less exciting. Um, 
doesn't the bills come on Monday? Well, Izzy, you know, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. <laughs> Octavia, Mim Bim, uh, Mim Bim, Soph, Liza, Arista, Galzane, Beth, thank you all for the subs. I wanted to show you one more thing. Um, Dan and I finally put up his lights in his office today. Um, so I want to show you. You probably don't remember what it looked like before, most of you, but um, look. Don't the lights look pretty? We hung them up. I'm very excited about it. So, <laughs> um, turn me off. <laughs> Stop opening my stream. This is some kind of what, what, what was it? I don't remember. It doesn't matter. Oh, wow. oh someone beat me with a tier three sub. Hello, sixteen months. Oh my god, thank you so much, little Cindy with the tier oh, wow. three twenty three months. Leg. You were literally seconds. Not to get like out, Sean. Not to like. That's not my me. fault. That they, they subbed right at the same time as me. <laughs> you like the lava lamp? Yeah, this um, Dan's brother gave him this for his birthday. It's kind of a fun gift. Um, but anyway, <laughs> that's what Dan's new lights look like. Um, okay, so the reason I didn't stream yesterday, I need to tell you all about this because it was like pitiful, and then I want to show you something horrible okay so basically yesterday um dan and i were trying to finish his adjustment of status packet and like finish filling out all the paperwork and stuff there's so many forms it is a nightmare so many you need to include so many copies of things like birth certificates and passports and all kinds of stuff it's just it is a long thick packet right that you have to mail in when you're like filing for adjustment of status um and so we like the forms aren't necessarily that hard to fill out and a lot of them you have to leave blank because it's like they use the same form for like lots of different categories of adjustment of status so like you can just fill out the parts that apply to you and it's fine it's just a lot of work to like get it all assembled well we finished it all yesterday finally we're ready we're gonna go mail it um i leave to go to the post office terrible traffic it's a nightmare okay Step one of a bad day. <laughs> also, I hate driving. Let's keep that in mind. Okay, we mail at the post office. It's fine. I tried to leave the post office. Terrible traffic. Cannot get out anywhere. Nightmare, okay? I decide to go the wrong way on purpose and try and go around. Not a good idea. It got worse. So at this point, I'm gonna be super late for the stream because like, I'm not home because there's so much bad happening. Then it starts pouring down rain and i need you to understand that I, <laughs> when i it got worse when i got home but like i sat in my driveway and cried in my car for a little bit and then i started raining more which was a mistake because then i was like soaking wet i'm gonna show you the video out of dan's office window i have literally never seen worse rain <laughs> than this it was raining so hard the gutters just like didn't matter like, it was so bad. I'm gonna show you. It's- I need to scroll up and find the video that I sent to my, um... Because I sent it to my friends. And I cropped it so that there would not be, um... You can't see out the window anyway because <laughs> there's so much rain. I just need you to understand, like, how bad this was, okay? Um, it's, it's kind of funny. It's not from the hurricane. The hurricane's not gonna hit here, luckily. Um... Okay, first of all, look at this, right? Okay. Kayla, come here. Um, so <laughs> it was raining a lot yesterday and that's why I didn't stream. So, it was like being in a car wash. That's what I said to my friends. I was like, Sasha, it's like someone is spraying a hose at my window. But it was the wind and the, the sky. <laughs> it's like you're on a boat or something. It was really bad. Anyway, um, everything was fine. But that, um, I did not stream yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> no, so the rain it was the rain wasn't that bad when I was driving home. It got that bad when I was at my house. Um but I swear, so keep in mind, like that um 
that rain, the gut, it was like so bad the gutters were like not even, it didn't matter that we had gutters because it was just falling off the house. Um, and so when I came into the house and like walked under the porch to come inside, it was bucketing on top of me. I got soaked just walking from like the sidewalk to my front door. <laughs> it was really bad. And that's why in the announcements, I was like, hang on, I'm sorry, I, got, I just got home, but I was going to change, like, it was not good, and then I didn't stream. Um, but anyway, it was great fun. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay, thank you for the sub gift. Hanny Ross, thank you for the five gifted subs. Uh, Brooklyn, Sammy, Yellow Dot, Muthi, BB, Shari, um, Son, Sarah, Hanny with the tier three two months, um, Charlie, uh, lol, Lauren, Oro, Meyer, Snapping Turtles, Space Kitten with a thousand bits, Gwen, Dark Knights, Beastie, Samantha, Helena, lol, Part of Your World, Ghosty, Wendy, Molly, oh, thank you all for the subs and stuff, everybody. Um, could have showered in the rain like a sim? No, i genuinely, though, it was so bad. It was raining so much. <laughs> and that's why, because I was in my office, and I, I could see the wind on these windows, and it was worse in there, and that's why Dan was like, Kayla, come here. <laughs> <laughs> Come look at this because in the video I was like it's so windy and then he was like you want to bet <laughs> You want to bet? Um, also, hi little Duke, <laughs> Katie, uh, Samantha, Brooklyn. Thank you all for the subs and stuff, too um, But yeah, I was not um, yesterday was a lot so <laughs> This front door is actually from university. It's technically from medium wall height. Um, this is one of my favorite doors in the whole game. I really like this door. It's, again, technically for medium wall height. It's, like, a little bit too tall, but I don't really care because it looks fine. Like, when you're looking at it, it looks, in my opinion, totally fine. So it doesn't bother me that much. Um, and then it's really short on medium wall height, you know? Like, it just, I, I feel like it looks better on short wall height. Yeah, it needs to be a little bit smaller or a little bit taller. <laughs> but I like this door, so I keep it on short wall height. Um, anyway, so we're gonna play with our Pods family today. Um, we are starting the sixth generation. This Sim, Jackie, is a young adult now, um, and she's gonna be the heir. So, quick recap, um, she's a writer. Uh, she's got an almost girlfriend, Polly. Uh, she has a twin brother called Jack, <laughs> and they have a stepsister called Holly. Um, these are their, their parents. Um, their parents are divorced. Trent and Carson have been divorced for a long time. Um, but uh, after their stepdad died, their stepdad was also Trent's stepdad. It was very confusing. Um, basically, my sim Carson divorced this guy Trent and then married Trent's stepdad by accident. Um, it was not good. Anyway, well, after after Martin died, <laughs> they decided to move back in to like be there together for the kids because this kid is um, Holly is Trent's little sister, his half sister. But. Yeah, it's really weird. <laughs> anyway, they um, they they live together again, but they in bunk beds because they're not together together. Um, they're just together for the family, you know. It's all very complicated. I it was an accident. <laughs> Played club kid, good crunch, Lainey, um, Maristol, Katie. Thank you, Kaylee, as well with the subs and stuff. Kaylee, I'm so sorry. That is really scary. I I hope everything's gonna be okay. Um, I'm so, so sorry. No, I know, Laura, it's so confusing. <laughs> the family tree situation with these people is so confusing. Um, let me see if I can show you. So, um, look, Trent, right? Trent married my sim, Carson, okay? They had two kids together. Um, Trent's mom, um, eventually, <laughs> uh, had a baby with her second husband, Martin. Well, after she died, my sim Carson got with Martin. It doesn't matter. They're all dead. It was very confusing. It wasn't on purpose. I married my ex-husband's stepdad, is all you need to know. <laughs> Annie Ross, thank you for the five gifted subs. Thank you so much. Um, Catherine, thank you for the bits. Hello, Kath, thank you for the 14 months. That is amazing. Congratulations. You said you recently started streaming, co-hosted a charity stream, and raised nearly $700 for the Trans Empowerment Project. That is huge, Hellcath. Congratulations. Um, Kels, Lady Sativa, Drew, thank you for the subs and bits and stuff, too, everybody. Um, you're so confused. Yeah, look, he's dead. <laughs> Would that be considered incest? No. No one's blood-related. Also, Carson marrying his ex-husband's stepdad 
This is all by marriage. Nothing going on there. Um, don't worry. <laughs> it's still weird. It, I more so think of it as being, like, I, I'm not thinking, like, oh, this was so creepy. I'm more thinking, that is so evil. <laughs> you, like, break this poor man's heart and then go and marry his dad. Like, <laughs> what is wrong with you? <laughs> um, that, that's more so how I see it, person- Ah! Do I have the earthquake trait on? I do not have the earthquake trait on. Do you know what? That happened to me earlier when I was in the apartment. I was, um, I was taking screenshots of the apartment for my thumbnail for my video today, and that was happening, but I thought it was like the lot No, we don't have the earth. This is the lot trait that does that, the quake zone one, but we don't have it on. That's a weird bug. Um, I apologize. <laughs> I don't know why that happened. Yeah, but I assumed it was just that apartment that was causing it, but... No, it's not my mouse, because that hasn't happened with anything else. It's the game. That's really creepy. <laughs> Ultraviolet, LPT, Jess, Catherine. Yeah, I totally forgot that earthquakes exist in this game, too. Anyway, earth the earthquake lot trait comes with, um, quake zone comes with city living. Again, I don't have that lot trait on, so that shouldn't have happened. That isn't like a cool new Sims feature, nor was it actually an earthquake. They didn't get any, um, like, moodlets from it. I think that was just a glitch. I might use simple living as well, just for fun. Um, well, <laughs> well, what is wrong with you? From quitting career? From getting eaten by a cow plant? My god. Have you tried not doing that? <laughs> Bebop, Ultraviolet, thank you for the subs. <laughs> um, Alondra, Obs, thank you everybody with the subs and bits and stuff too. Um, the rocket ships are bugged too. Oh, I didn't know that. I haven't played with rocket ships in a little bit. I mean, I'm not surprised. Okay. Um... Anyway, I'm sorry if that happens again, because I know that's kind of like a weird, like, shaky visual, but I, if it's glitching, I don't know how to- I don't know how to stop it from happening again. Um, oh well. We'll see what happens. Should be fine. Maybe it was a one-off. <laughs> um, Sarah, thank you for the bits! Um, <laughs> you just broke your TV, and I got the honor of being the last thing played on it. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Well, at least it's not my fault. Wait, my cow plant- oh, I'm gonna freak out. I found that if you put the cow plant in and out of your household inventory, it usually, um, fixes it when it breaks like that. Let me sell this. Maybe I should sell some of these random things, to be honest with you. Like, some of these books I do not need. And we're not gonna have enough money for bills. No, that one didn't die. This one died. Oh, it did it again! This one's the dead one. What? When will they ever fix? I... I don't know. Do you know what? Just don't worry about it. Do you know what else? I've been saving this for a rainy day. <laughs> My Sims got this from, um, from career thing. It's 10,000 simoleons. I don't think I want to sell it yet, though. Some of this stuff I want to keep. I can get rid of that. Yeah, I need some of these things still. For example, my chickens. This game has a lot of bugs right now. I know The Sims 4 is, like, always bugged, but part of me is feeling like it's more bugged than usual. I know that's a brave statement, but there's been a lot more, like, really bizarre bugs recently than usual 
that feel more game breaking to me. <laughs> like the screen shaking and the teleporting and stuff. They fixed the teleporting, but like there's been some um some problems recently. <laughs> Uh, Mario Sunshine, Ben, Sunshine, thank you for the subs. Declan with the 42 months. Oh my god. Uh, Jazzy, thank you for the seven months too. Your Lexi Challenge Air hates children? Oh no. <laughs> to be fair, that kind of makes for an interesting generation. Um, very unfortunate for the children in that family. Uh, but that is kind of an interesting generation. Um,. I don't like to play The Sims that way. I don't like to play The Sims with like the parents being mean to the kids. That <laughs> makes me really uncomfortable. <laughs> um, but I mean, it's kind of fun when like the legacy heirs get bad traits, you know? Um, something about it is more interesting. This one isn't that bad. Dance Machine, Dog Lover, Creative. I've been randomizing their traits. So we kind of get stuck with stuff. Um, like I wouldn't have, personally, I don't think I would have chosen Dance Machine. <laughs> Um, as my first choice for traits, but that's not your bedroom. What? Are you? Go away. Anyway, I don't think I would have personally chosen Dance Machine, but, um, you know. <laughs> Dance Machine chose you, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Sunflower, Strawberry, thank you both for the resubs. I don't, I never play with the Dance Machine trait. That's why it really is more fun to randomize traits than pick them, because, like, I, I would never, ever have selected the dance machine trait. A hundred percent would not have picked it. So maybe it's fun. Um, the cow plant's not from a pack. Okay, bye. The cow plant's just base game. Um, so you can just use the cow plant. You don't need to have anything special or anything. Um, they are kind of hard to get, I guess. Like, if you get them the, the real way, you have to splice together a bunch of different plants to grow the cow plant berry. But you can also very easily find cow plant berries when you fish in the way back of the park in Oasis Springs. Like, the farthest back pond in Oasis Springs in that park. You can fish up cow plant berries really easily in there. So if you just go fish in there, you'll probably get the seed so you can plant one. Um, but yeah, it's just base game. So... If I had to stay for a weekend with the Potts or my other legacy family, who would I pick? What, in real life? I'm sorry, but I am not visiting this house. Look, there's a kid, the cat's attacking somebody right now. <laughs> no, um, I would, you, I would not stay in this house. In real life? No way. No way. You will not catch me in here. Okay. We decided that, um, where are you sleeping? That's not your bed. What? Why are you doing that? That's not your bed. That's your dad's. So anyway, her parents, um, we decided that because Trent is the one who is nicer, um, he gets the bigger bed. <laughs> because Carson is the reason for the divorce, he gets the top bunk. The Bell Legacy fire toilet scares me. To be fair, my YouTube series, they do have a toilet that catches on fire periodically, so I suppose that is a genuine thing to be concerned about. Um, but just don't use the downstairs toilet. That's fine. <laughs> Nitwit, McBrit, um, Olivia, thank you all for the subs. Shan Shan with a tier two, 28 months. I am so excited for you and your new puppy. That is awesome. Um, and Smiley Bubbles, thank you for the four months too. Oh my goodness. All right, everyone go to sleep. Don't we all have a toilet we don't use for fear of it catching fire? Well, yeah, what is, is your downstairs toilet not a fire hazard in your house? Thought everybody had that problem. <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> Future. Chanelli, thank you for the subs. Okay. I think he woke up because he got scared of the ghosts. I'm sorry, we have a big ghost problem in this house, um, unsurprisingly, you know. So this ghost, Lacey, is one of their uncle's wives from a long time ago. Um... So, yeah. I rebuilt the house last week, allegedly. The last time we streamed the Paws family, I rebuilt the house. 
So we wanted a new one because we're starting the new generation. Um, now that the Sims gonna be the heir, we wanted to get a new house going. We also have ghosts of our pets around. Um, don't worry, I didn't kill any of them. They all died of old age. <laughs> Um, but just so you, I always really need to clarify that because I did kill a lot of these Sims, but all the pet gravestones, you can't kill pets in the Sims. Um, they can die, but only of old age. So I didn't like do anything. Um, Mason, I usually stream six days a week, uh, Monday through Saturday. I don't stream on Sundays, but I usually stream six days a week. Um, I've, I've had a weird stream schedule this week, like way different than normal. Um, cause I've had a lot going on. <laughs> um. I'll tell you about it next week, <laughs> but it's been a weird stream schedule. Um, but yeah, usually we stream six days a week. Um, for example, like I didn't stream yesterday because, um, well, I was crying in the post office parking lot and then it started pouring down rain and it was a disaster and I didn't get home in time to stream. So, um, <laughs> Tania, thank you for the 17 months. Why is everyone awake so early? He finished his aspiration. What should I get? Wait. What should I buy with our extra points? Because I, look, I could so easily get, like, the money tree. But I don't want the money tree. Because the money tree, I don't know. Like, it, it's too much money. <laughs> the money tree is simply way too much money. I should have spent more of his. Never need to shower or bathe. Never gets scared, retrading, never needs to socialize, gain skills faster, hardly hungry. I see, like, what's the point? Nothing is the point. He's gonna die. Like, he's, I don't, I don't mean to use a mod to check, but I give him three days. Two days! He's gonna be alive for two days. <laughs> There's no point in buying, like, a trait to gain skills faster if he's gonna die. So, maybe I'll just get frugal for now. And then we'll have cheaper bills for two days. <laughs> That's rough, yeah. Mermaid fruit. Oh. That's really easy to get, though. It's only 500. Maybe I'll buy some extra. Are you getting attacked? Are you attacking the ghost from through a wall? Okay. Okay. Hilda, I don't have any shaders. Um, it might be my graphic settings. Um, I'm running The Sims on Ultra right now, which, oh no. All I can make is mud carp. Anyway, I'm running The Sims on Ultra right now. Um, because my PC can, um, but like obviously most computers will not run The Sims on Ultra because The Sims is very hard to run. Um, so that might be why, it might be your graphic settings, um, which isn't your fault. That's just The Sims is hard to run on computers. So, um. <laughs> cats can attack ghosts through walls, yeah. Okay, why do you have a piano book? Where'd you get that from? Is that someone's? Trent's essence of sadness as well. You're weird. <laughs> okay. Hanny, thank you for the five gifted subs. Unicorn, uh, Kame, Pugnado, Samantha, Ghosty, Alondra, Tania, all with the subs and bits and stuff too. Thank you so much. Oh yeah, it's bad on console too. Yeah. No, you're not wrong. <laughs> Katie, thank you for the thousand bits as well. Okay. Toast has passed his peak and has become an elderly cat? This is a really horrible day. <laughs> Just an absolutely horrible, horrible day. Yeah, and our laptop's broken. It is rebate day, so maybe I'll spend some money once my sims get home from work. Maybe I'll spend some money. Um, oh, actually, barely anybody works. Perhaps this will not be good for us today. 
get an age down treat at the vet. No, Lisa, I'm not gonna use an age down treat or anything. Um, while I do not want my Sims cat to die, I also don't want to, like, cheat, um... I should not use the Simple Living Law trait right now. We only have 800 simoleons. It's just not a good idea. <laughs> it is not a good idea. <laughs> uh, Neighbor Dan, thank you for the eight-month resub. Um, no, we can get grocery delivery really easily, Raven. It's just we only have 800 simoleons and we're gonna have bills today. Um, which leads me to think, hmm, maybe I shouldn't do that. You know? Just a thought. 263 from their retirement. That's good. No! Oh my god. Cow plants are so glitchy. Whenever they do that, just put them in your inventory. It fixes it. Bizarre. Very bizarre. Come on. Okay, feed. 117 and 146. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's better than nothing, right? Also, you got electrocuted? That is my air. You need to be more careful. What is the perks of having a cow plant? Oh, no, no. No, Tasha, no. <laughs> there are none. It is a deadly, deadly creature. It will kill your Sims autonomously. Don't- it, there's no perks of the cow plant. It's just funny. <laughs> um, I built this house on my stream. I haven't posted this, um, on YouTube. I might at some point, but I haven't posted it on stream. Um, but back, yeah, back before we had pets, back in the olden days when we didn't have pets in The Sims 4, um, many of us had cow plants. So, yeah, this one's hungry, but this one is supposed to be dead. This one died, and then I reset it by accident. Um, but, like, because, you know, when you put in your inventory when they glitch, like, it just, I don't know, it wasn't, it's not supposed to be alive. Also, happy birthday, Maya. I can sing you a birthday song. Where's my harmonica? Um, Kat, Wendy, Rebecca, Amy, thank you for the subs and bits to everybody. Uh. Oh, God. Okay. Sentiment gained. Oh, that's nice. Well, I'm thinking, I know that we have work today, but I kind of want to invite over Polly. We have work at 11, so I could totally hang out with Polly this morning, right? They're not dating yet, but at the very least, we can just, like, hang out. Chat. Do you know, Miss and Miss, yes. <laughs> The birthday songs were a lot more fun and a lot easier to do when, uh, the stream was smaller. Because, obviously, like, it was a lot, um, easier to catch them. But now, because I don't see every message in chat, obviously, um, people, like, ask, and then I don't see it, and then they get upset, and then they're like, you're ruining my birthday, and I'm like, I didn't even see your first message! <laughs> I'm sorry! Um, yeah, it was, um... Yeah. We're doing our best, though. <laughs> yeah, I like Polly, too. I think this... Oh, I don't think Polly likes me. I just heard Dan actually scream. Like, actually scream. He went, ah! No! <laughs> Sometimes, Dan is, because he's playing Dead by Daylight right now, um, sometimes I just catch, like, random little <laughs> things like that. <laughs> Propose? Oh. Okay, maybe we are dating her. Oh, yeah, we are dating. <laughs> I was like, I don't think they're in an exclusive relationship yet. And then it was like, do you want to propose? Okay, we are dating. Is Dan okay? Well, he probably just got got in Dead by Daylight. He's fine. He's fine. When is the Stardew Valley Olympics? Okay, not today, but next Saturday, Finny. Next Saturday at noon Eastern time uh, is the Stardew Valley tournament that we're going to be in. Um, 
What are Polly's traits? That's a good question. Um, snob. <laughs> we probably should get to know her a little bit better first, huh, before we marry her. <laughs> Miv, with the tier 2 30 months, you said, I am hate wearing your merch. Okay. <laughs> um, Stardew Olympics, that's not the technical term, but that's what the person just said in chat, so I thought it was funny I repeated it. Um, there's not a Stardew Olympics, but there is a big Stardew Valley tournament this weekend, um, like hosted by Concerned Ape, the person who made the game. Um, there's 16 people in it. Um, it's basically a speedrunning competition, but there's a lot of like things we have to do, like various tasks that earn various amounts of points, and the goal is to get as many points as possible. Um, but that's on Saturday at noon Eastern time. So, um, I have been practicing a lot. <laughs> Am I gonna win? I don't know, Sunshine. I don't wanna give, I don't wanna, um, get my hopes up. And let's be real. If Habu was not on my team, I would be a flop. <laughs> but, um, Habu is a really good speedrunner. Um, and he's very smart and knows everything about Stardew Valley. So, <laughs> But obviously the whole competition is full of speedrunners. It's like half speedrunners and half like people like me um, Who play a lot of Stardew, but are not by any means an expert or a speedrunner, you know, um, I know the game really well, but I'm not like a Speedrunner <laughs> um, I'm an average runner. I feel like I'm a little bit more so than a casual player, but I'm I'm definitely way more of a casual player than most of the like speedrunner types in the tournament, you know um, I'm a jogger. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I, I like to jog in Stardew Valley. No speed running, but jogging. Speed walking, perhaps? Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, I need you to come watch a movie or something, Bessie. Happy, uh, Porta, Mason, Apollo, thank you for the subs. Um, Porta, I am so sorry to hear that. I love you. Thank you so much for the bits, um, or for the five, sorry, for the five month resub, and I, I am sending you so much love. Um, hi with the three months, Kyle with the bits, thanks everybody. Um, Power Walker. <laughs> and Token Rose, thanks for sending your sub through October. I appreciate that. Okay, I'm gonna have my sim work hard at work today, because I really want the money. You work until seven? Oh, don't work hard. Work normal. That makes me feel sad. Okay, anyway, Jack. Jack is the one that we have started to try and woo this mermaid with. Perhaps I will send her a text and see if she wants to hang out with me. You know? What's the goal of a legacy challenge? To play through 10 generations, basically. Um, it's not that complicated. There's different kinds of legacy challenge you could play. Um, some of them have, like, way more complicated rules and, like, point systems and stuff. I don't really care about that. Um, I mostly, in my mind, a legacy, you start out with, like, an empty lot and 1,800 simoleons, and that's it. And then you try and play and slowly build up your house and your family as you get through, like, 10 generations. That's how I play legacy challenges, but, um, there's different ways. Um, Spacing, thank you for the nine months. I appreciate that. Okay, I need these two to get married. And fast. Can't I close the door? What door? My door? Dan's door and my door are closed. You can't hear Dan that much. It's not that big of a deal. It's very occasionally. <laughs> very, very occasionally. Have I ever played the not so berry challenge? This one? The Not So Berry Legacy Challenge written by me and my friend Zoe. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, Beth, thank you for this sub gift. Um, yeah, me and Zoe wrote it when I was in high school, so I made, um, I haven't played it in a while, but. Uh, yeah, me and Zoe wrote the not-so-berry challenge. They kissed! 
Don't walk away! You need to date this sim. It's very important. It's urgent! I want you to move out of my house. <laughs> I need you to start dating so that you can leave. Whisper seductively. We're gonna play Not So Very again. What we're gonna do next on stream after we finish this, I already promised this a long time ago, um, but once we finish this 10 generation challenge, um, we're on gen six right now. Um, once we get through gen 10, we're gonna play Not So Very again on stream. Um, that's the plan. That's always been the plan. So, oh, we're dating. Wait, can I propose to her right now? I might. I might propose. We can make some new CC and everything. I'll do some custom recolors of lipstick and hair <laughs> um, so that we can have some fun ones. It'll be nice. It'll be nice. Um, uh oh. I promised this way longer ago, Philippa. I promised not so very way before that. So. Um, they got engaged. I didn't really think that was gonna happen that fast. Okay. Have made CC myself. Yeah, making recolors is not that difficult. Um, I made a video where I made uh, some CC versions of my merch and it looks like I didn't know how to do it because there was some glitching, but I found out from my dear CC creator friends um, that it's not my fault. The hoodie I was trying to recolor is just massively warped and not, I like, I'm not gonna go into Blender and try and fix it because I don't know how to do that. But recoloring it really isn't that big of a, a, a thing. That's easier to do. I've made lots of recolors of hair and makeup. Like when I first played Not So Berry years ago when we made it, I used to make Forever Generation like a custom lipstick, like for like the mint sim, I made like a custom blue lipstick that matched her hair perfectly and stuff. Um, so um, that's how I did it. <laughs> it's kind of fun that way, um, but. Did I click try for baby? I didn't do that on purpose fully. Maybe I did and I I didn't really think about the consequences. Cause I clicked it, but I don't really think I thought that through very well. Like, <laughs> I, I don't, hmm. Okay. So, we're gonna have a baby. <laughs> Perhaps I will send them away. It's gonna be a mermaid. She's a mermaid. Kill them in the pond and keep the baby. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Solitude, Shy, Mallory, Samantha, Beth, um, thank you for the subs. I'm gonna go, um, maybe I'll let them live in Sulani. Let's see. I need to make, oh, he can just live with her. They have lots of money too, okay. What, where does she live? Like, what house? Hmm. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, they're fine. They've got a great house. A lovely house. Anyway, so Jack was never going to be the heir. He was going to move. That's why I was trying to have him date the mermaid so that they could move out and leave me alone. Um, so I just, I think I did that a little bit faster than I intended. Um, but we needed him gone so that we could start the next generation. Um, doesn't have furniture. That's their problem. Who needs furniture in The Sims? 
not them. So. <laughs> okay, anyway. House is smaller now. I'm gonna be a lot happier this way. Maybe I should take away his sweater. That's, to be fair, if he's gonna live in Sulani, his sweater is probably not the most appropriate outfit choice, but that's not my problem. You know? Don't pro- why did I click scare? I wanted to, like, be nice to the cat, because I'm scared the cat's gonna run away. Oh, no, I'm not feeding this cow plant on purpose. If you missed it, um, this cow plant was dead. This one was alive. Um, but this cow plant came back to life because there's been these weird cow- I wonder if I can make it happen. There's been these weird cow plant glitches recently, like that, where it resets back to tiny. Um, and then you have to put it in your inventory to fix it, and then you put it back, and then it, like, comes back. It's very bizarre. Um, well, the cow plant was dead, and then it came back to life when I did that. So I think I might just let it die again, because it's not supposed to be alive. <laughs> Feels like I'm cheating. With the fact that it's back. Like, that's why it's in the grave section. <laughs> Should Holly invite over classmate Layla? Yeah? Who's Layla? Uh-oh. 2,400 simoleon bills? Okay, team. We are gonna have to get a move on here. Okay. Um, let's think this through. <laughs> Um, <laughs> does anybody- okay, you have some fertilizer. Wait, he has a can- oh, wait, we can sell that stuff? Okay. He's got the soccer balls. Okay. He can fish. He's max level. I don't want to- I don't want to, um, sell things from my household inventory because I like them. So I won't sell anything yet. Oh, it's Layla. Well, I'm gonna age up into a young adult, like, literally right now, so I probably shouldn't hang out with Layla very much, but we could talk to her. <laughs> Flick nose. Angle for big catch? Oh, I should have done that instead, shouldn't I have? Um... Steal from the mermaid? The money tree's looking good right about now. No, I don't want the money tree. I don't want to have too much money. It's so sad when you have too much money. I mean, it's more sad when you have no money, but it, I don't want to have too much money. Charo, thank you for the 14-month reset, too. Um, yeah, we just built a new house, which is part of the problem. <laughs> um, I spent too much money. I didn't save any for the bills. So, it's okay. We're gonna bake our own little cake here. I'll have my sim age up. It'll be great. <laughs> Emily, Boba. <laughs> Thank you for the subs. What's wrong with you? You've been making some waves? Maybe I'll accept this job and then quit. Because you get a bonus. <gasps> I can pay my bills! Yes! Okay. <laughs> And then I'll just quit. Oh, I'll just retire, actually. Give me some pension there. Fixed. <laughs> Problem solved. Go pay the bills. Easy. Easy. Look, I don't know what they were expecting. He's had a long life. He worked a lot. And now, we're getting paid for it. Oh, we have things in the mail, too. Maybe they're presents that we can sell. Yeah, to be fair, he is about to die as well. <laughs> He's got two days left in game. <laughs> He's an elder. Um, okay. Where did you put the cake? No, 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 no. Oh, that is a terrible quality cake as well. Can you add birthday candles to it? Do you hear a faint buzzing in the house? Is something broken? 
Am I imagining it? What's broken? Dishwasher? Oh! I thought it was just running. No, it is just running. I swear it sounds like the broken Roomba. The laptop's not broken. I keep checking that. What is going on? Is there something under the stairs? No? Oh my god, it's the computer upstairs. The upstairs computer is broken. I swear, I feel like I was imagining things. I forgot I had a computer upstairs. <laughs> All right, time for Holly to age up. Blow out the candles. No, the cake's not spoiled. She just did a really bad job cooking it. All right, we randomized the traits here. Ready, three, two, one. Green Fiend, I mean, Recycle Disciple. <laughs> recycle Disciple, Erratic, and Evil. <sighs> Is it because your birthday cake was bad? Is that why? <laughs> She's evil, but she loves recycling. I mean, that checks out, right? You can be a bad person and still enjoy recycling. We've been having a lot of evil sims recently. Randomized as well. Which feels unfair to me, but... No, I'm not gonna take this job. See, we're getting too much money. I need you to finish this because the noise is bothering me so much, please. Oh, did I get promoted? Oh, thank God. Okay, what are our... We got the word processor. Got a bonus. We're level two now. Same work schedule, that's not so bad. Should I invite over Polly? Is Polly still here? Polly is in my bedroom. Oh, <laughs> oh, she stayed all day, okay. <laughs> uh, Muggle, Bob Pancakes, thank you for the tier 2 five months. Um, Ponado, Wendy, um, Anna, Clocky with the 45 months. Oh my god. Isabel, Emily, thank you so much. Oh. Sorry. Is Polly or Holly the new successor? No. Holly is not blood related to the heir. Um, this heir, Carson is the heir. Polly is his stepdaughter. I mean, Holly. Oh, that's so confusing. Holly is his stepdaughter. Uh, Jackie is his biological daughter. Um, he met Holly when she was older. Uh, her dad is dead. Um, but this guy is her brother. And Trent also happens to be Carson's ex-husband. It's all very complicated. Um, don't worry about it. <laughs> don't worry about it. <laughs> Okay, if she likes recycling so much, maybe I'll put her in, like, the gardening career? She can be one with nature. And also... What just cost me a hundred simoleons? Who spent money? But look, there's plants on the wall. She loves it. And then Jackie will be the new heir. And Jackie's probably gonna marry Polly. <gasps> you wanna go on a date? Okay. When Trent dies, is Polly gonna move out? Yeah, probably. Should I move out before then, too? I don't know. It depends what happens to... No, not Polly. Holly. Holly is the sister. Polly is the girlfriend. Very confusing. I apologize. <laughs> I want to have them take photos together really quick. Before I forget. 
What am I doing? Take photo with Polly. <laughs> she also has an aunt named Holly. Look. Holly. Jackie's girlfriend, Polly. His stepdaughter, also Holly. I didn't name the stepdaughter Holly. Um, she was named that already. And this sim is named Holly because her dad was Santa. So. <laughs> um, is Polly's mom called Holly? I don't remember doing that. Although I wouldn't be surprised if I did that. Okay, well, my fun is very low. There's not much to do here. Um, no, the mom is Molly. That's right. I think that's correct. I think that Polly's mom is called Molly. It's weird. I know. It's all very complicated. <laughs> Just don't... Just don't think about it too much. <laughs> Canadian Christina, thank you for the subs. Yeah, just don't, don't worry about it. It's fine. Everything's fine. I wonder, so we don't have work tomorrow. Maybe we could go get engaged tomorrow. That could be fun. I like that. Emma, thank you for the love month resub. Okay. Embrace. I'm trying to tell her jokes because my fun is so low. I'm like, maybe I can get my fun up by joking around with her. Hey, you found a prismatic shard in an Omnigeo. That is nice music. Oh, that just scared me. Um, that's exciting in Stardew. Um, also, wife, thank you for the Prime sub too. Can we name the Air Dolly? We did talk about that as a possibility for the next generation. It is really confusing. Name the cat Lolly after Stardew Valley, you know? <laughs> okay, these two, I think they're really cute together. I'm excited about this. Oh. Maybe we could go home. I'm gonna go back. Let's see. Bring Polly. Really, Hasna? Thank you so much. I appreciate that. You just caught a legendary fish in Stardew? Nice. Very nice. My headphones are tangled. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, mess, mess, mess. They're all tangled. Oh, no. Oh, big mistake. How does that always happen? Oh, my God. Oh! Violent. Okay, we're not feeding that one because that one is glitched and it's supposed to be dead. It was has been dead and then it came back to life. So I'm not gonna feed it because I'm not a cheater. I might have them woohoo though. Come on. Come on. Alright. Everyone else, it's only eleven. I feel bad like sending you to bed, but I kind of want to start the next day. The problem is that if we go to the next day, then my sims are all going to die. <laughs> okay. Oh, they're woohooing for the first time. Okay. No, wait, you don't get the good bed. Sorry, Carson has to have the top bunk because he was mean to Trent. That's why I got divorced. So I try and get to the better bed on the bottom bunk. <laughs> I realize this is really dumb, but that's the situation. I need to keep remembering to make sure that Carson does not get the better bed. <laughs> um, he does not deserve it. Carson is mean. Okay. Well, I might ask you to leave. Sorry. It's just that you were at my house literally all day. <laughs> um, and then we'll, uh, I guess we can get engaged tomorrow. That could be fun. We'll take her to the park or something. It'll be nice. Um, it's supposed to be decent weather. 
I don't know where we'll get engaged, though. Love Day is on Friday. Maybe they could get married on Love Day. Well, that could be fun. Oh, the cow plant died. <laughs> Lovely. Like I said, that cow plant has been dead for a long time. It just reset. The cow plants are so glitched. Ah! It's almost cursed. It's time. Maybe most of these final days. Okay. Maybe we should get married before Friday. <laughs> maybe we should get married faster than Friday. <laughs> At the very least, we should get engaged today. <laughs> Oh dear. Okay. Well, um, even today might be too late. So, oh well. Yeah, Isabella, I think we're gonna have them have bi biological kids. I usually do that in my legacies. I just set it so that one of them can get the other pregnant and we just, it's IVF, it's fine. The Sims is a wonderful future where anybody can have kids if they want. <laughs> so, um, cause it's just fun to have the biological kids because it's like, it's fun to like mix the genetics and stuff, you know? Um, but I think that's the plan. That's what we've been doing. I mean, that's what we had Trent and Carson do and stuff, so. Ew! Why is the bed still stinky? Is that just from you standing there a second ago? That is very gross. <laughs> that is very gross. Okay, well... I have to clean it for a thousand. <sighs> okay. No, the furniture can't actually get stinky. It just was hovering because he was just there. It's not actually stinky furniture or anything. Um, who's the hamster ghost? Oh, that's just one of their uncles. He died a long time ago. He died of rabid rodent fever. Which is why he looks like he has the hamster costume on for his ghost. Um, that's because uh, the rat killed him. So, oh, why are you so sleepy? No, I, I might cheat her needs. <laughs> hey, honey, thank you for the tier three resub as well. Thank you so much. Yeah, no, we're getting married today. I'm sorry. I, my dad's gonna, like, we have to before he drops dead. It's very important. Oh, no, don't walk in on him in the bathroom. Maybe she could, like... Do you want to work on writing this morning for a second? We haven't finished a single book yet. At the very least, we can get some of that. Okay. Yeah, we're not doing so good when it comes to money in this. <laughs> okay. Anyway, we have a lot of random ghosts that have died a lot of scary ways because we've been on so many generations. So, um, Julie, thank you for the seven months. Um, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Okay. I think everything's okay. Who's calling? Oh, Holly has work? No, don't mourn that sim. See, there are some random sims that aren't even related to us. Like, at least two, maybe three sims have died. Like, on lots that I was also on. Like, I was at the bar and then somebody died. I was at the park and then somebody died. And so I brought their graves home with me instead of just leaving at the park. Because I felt bad just, like, leaving my <laughs> this random sim's grave at the park. So I brought it home. Um, but now sometimes I have their ghosts. And I don't want to, like, send them away because I like them. I like having their ghosts on occasion. But, like, I don't need my sims to mourn them. I'm not really sure what to do. Anyway, I'm gonna go ask Polly on a date. Watch her say no. <laughs> Aura, thank you for the bits. Um, oh my god, that is a wild idea. Um, and yeah, thank you for the sub as well. Yeah, Ron, thank you for the sub too. Um, okay, let me go. Where should we get engaged? I know the weather is okay in Willow Creek. I am, maybe I'll just go next door because I'm scared the weather's gonna be bad. Like imagine we go to, I don't know, Brindleton Bay thinking it'll be pretty and then all of a sudden it's a downpour and then you get stuck in the post office parking lot crying and have to cancel your stream. <sighs> what would I know about that? <laughs> what would I know about bad weather? <laughs> <laughs> okay, 
Okay. Could it be me? <laughs> I'm gonna go out and get engaged. I know we. L Why is the cow plant stinking? Do I just. I probably shouldn't just straight up propose. I should probably like. Have them talk first, right? <laughs> feels wrong to be like, hello, you have just arrived, here is a ring. We need to make it more special or something. <laughs> uh, Madison, thank you for the 17 month resub too. Okay. This is my sibling's friend. Can you, I'm like kind of busy. <laughs> Why did you come and stand right in front of me? <laughs> That's sort of awkward, your choice to be right there. Kinda nosy, yeah. Hold hands, that's nice. Okay, would you mind like standing right here instead so I can get a better angle with the tree? Come on. Just scoot a tiny, no, come here. You shoo! Shoo! What, you look like me! picked where the sims all spawn. I picked it because I like the tree. Maybe we could come further down. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have her propose just right now. I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna do it. What if she says no? Hang on, I want a picture with the tree in the background. Instead, I have a trash can in the background. Um, you know, did not really go according to plan, but that's okay. That's fine. Okay, of course she said yes. <laughs> well, this is fun. Now we can start Gen 7. <laughs> Tiny Madison, thank you for the subs. But so this sim is the generation six heir. So their kids will be the seventh generation. Which is kind of fun. I might have her move in. Don't all up immediately, not yet. Um. I can't ask her to yet. If I don't get proposed to on a busy sidewalk next to a trash can, I don't want it. <laughs> yeah, that is my dream. Yeah. I don't know about you guys, but my whole life when I pictured, you know, being proposed to, I always thought, you know what, it'd be really nice if there was a trash can right there. Um, that would just be perfect. <laughs> to be fair, there's trash cans everywhere. It's just that, like, I don't know, when you look at the angles, the photo is very much, like, me, trash can. Me, trash can. <laughs> you know, like, there's not much else to look at around, the, around here, so, um, that's the problem. <laughs> Okay, I can't, maybe I'll have them become best friends. Perhaps then I can ask her to move in. Come on, come on, come on. Why are you using a future cube in the middle of my proposal? <laughs> this is, no, they came in, they're like, wait, I need to predict the future. Will this work out? Um, that's my cat and her new toy. It's, um, it's a shark. <laughs> so, let me get a picture of her. Don't move. Okay, I need to be very careful. Oh, I did not get a very good picture. You can barely see the, okay. This is fine. I zoomed in a lot because there's a box with my address on it next to her and I don't want to show you that, so. <laughs> um, I'll show it to you. It's a big shark toy. Cat. Toy. She laid, laid like flopped over when I looked at her, but. <laughs> 
Um, it's kind of cute. She likes it. She likes those, like, kicker toys, like the long... You also have a shark kicker toy? Really? That's kind of fun, Hope. Um... <laughs> yeah, she likes kicker toys a lot. Um, I try to, like, space out when I- cause she sort of, like, uses them for a long time and then gets sick of them. So, I try to, like, space out giving them to her. So, she- I've had this one for a while. I finally gave it to her today. Um, thought it was gonna be the same. Yeah, I'm sorry. Um, okay. Um, Christine, I'm gonna give that person the benefit of the doubt and hope that they meant, like, ooh, like, about these two. <laughs> Although, understandable. Hard to tell from a second message. <laughs> anyway, kicker toys are, like, um, I'll show you one of her other ones. This one is weird, but they're like this, like, long, skinny cat toys. She used to love this one, um, but she doesn't use it as much anymore. But they, she grabs it and then kicks it. <laughs> Um, but, like this. <laughs> Cats are really funny. But yeah, she's liking this new one, so. <laughs> she is funny. Okay, well, you are kind of in my way here. Would you mind leaving? Like I said, kind of proposing. So, if you could just, like... <laughs> really, Bexy? See, my cat plays with, like, everything. Snap just loves toys in general. <laughs> um, obviously, toys with catnip inside are a, a perk, but she just plays with everything. She tries to take things off my shelves to play with, too. <laughs> um, Lisa, that's awesome. Congratulations. Um, to her and Tiny Child Madison, thank you all for the subs, too. I think I read those multiple times. Oh well, thanks again. <laughs> Had that one too for your dog? Really, Esther? Yeah, I didn't even buy that toy, that pink one I just showed you. Chewy sent that to me. They gave me, they sent me like a box that had that toy, um, something else, and a, a cow costume for a cat. Um, and it, I think it was because I have purchased three cat trees from Chewy. And so they <laughs> were like, hope your cat loves this too. <laughs> but I like, I have two cat trees here and I bought one as a gift for my parents as well. Um, so I have purchased three cat trees for Chewy, from Chewy. So they sent me a box with a couple cat toys in it for free. <laughs> I like Chewy. I think they're cool. Um, but <laughs> Um, yeah, I, I did purchase a lot of cat trees, so. Um, you want to see Snap in the cow costume? I only put it on her once. Um, she lets me do things like that to her, but I feel bad. Um, so I haven't, I haven't put it on her again since. <laughs> but, uh, why can't I ask you to move in with me, please? Please? Do you want to live with me? Please? Please? Oh, very playful. That's not good. That's not good. Get married in 34 days? Hey, Megan, that's so exciting. Oh my god. So, <laughs> speaking of which, I, um, I went to my P.O. box yesterday because I was at the post office mailing, like, Dan's adjustment of status stuff, um, and so I checked my P.O. box while I was there, and I kid you not, this is the first time this has ever happened to me, like, two-thirds of the letters in my P.O. box yesterday were graduation announcements. No one has ever sent me a graduation announcement before, but, like, almost all of the letters yesterday were <laughs> graduation announcements. Just like, a, like, you know, like a photo of somebody being like, hey, so-and-so graduated from such-and-such -such university with this degree. Like, <laughs> well, so many of them were graduation announcements, which I thought was kind of cute. I liked it. Um, but I've never gotten sent them before, but I, I swear to God I had, like, 12. <laughs> like, a bunch of them. Um, oh, maybe it's because the I have the date happening still. I can't ask her to move in. Oh, you're right, probably. Yeah, there you go. Um, anyway, that was kind of cute. So, <laughs> um, I forgot about the event being on. 
You'll send me yours? I hope to see it. No, her mom's name is Holly. Okay. <laughs> there are three Sims named Holly in this family now. Um, Holly, Holly, and then this guy's sister, also Holly. I gave myself a little bit of money. Just a little bit of money. Yeah, and that's right. Uh, Polly's gonna be an interior designer. So, this should be fun. <laughs> Take the cat? I feel bad taking the cat away from the mom. Cause like, she's by herself now. I don't know. I don't know. Anybody else here named Holly? Okay. Well, I'm gonna go to sleep. Raven, um, I've gotten an invite to somebody's wedding one time, um, but only once. <laughs> I have gotten those graduation announcements in the mail for the first time though. Um, I think like obviously, what is that? Oh, oops. Obviously they're not like actually inviting me, <laughs> but um, it was kind of funny. Um, it's weird because you open like your PO box and there's like a really fancy envelope. It's got like wax seal, you know, <laughs> somebody's wedding invitation. Um, would I go to a fan's wedding if it was drivable distance? I don't think so. I don't know if they actually want me there. I feel like it'd be weird. Like this is like a very personal family event for them. And I don't, I don't know anybody. I don't even know them. <laughs> you know, like I feel like, um, I'm not sure if it's a good idea. I feel like, I don't know, I don't know. I don't think that's a thing that I would feel comfortable doing. I've only been to um, two weddings as well. I went to my friend Megan's wedding and I went to my cousin's wedding. Um, and those are my only wedding experience. I don't really know if I wanna to go to your wedding though. Chat, I'm sorry. <laughs> but could you imagine you send a wedding invite to like a random YouTuber and they RSVP back, yes. And they like actually show up. <laughs> what would you do? If you got an RSVP yes, would you like, s like take them seriously? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, Boombox, Inner Dialogue, Joey, Megan, thank you for the subs and bits. Valentine, thank you for the two gifted subs too. Um, anyway, it's interesting. Um, yeah, I would take them seriously, too, because you'd assume they wouldn't, like, joke about it. But imagine you, like, take their yes seriously, you buy them a plate, and then they don't show up. That would be rude. I'm talking to you, celebrities. <laughs> oh, Holly has texted us. I heard that you got engaged. Congratulations. I'm so excited for you and Polly. <laughs> okay, wait, I wanted to pick a, a gig. Um, I guess we'll pick a room renovation gig. So that'll be fun. I'll do it tomorrow. Um. <laughs> okay. Um. See, Michael, I always hear that, right? Um, about people, like, sending rich people invites to their weddings because they, they assume that, like, the assistant will think they actually know them and, like, send a gift anyway. But in my mind, I'm picturing, like, big celebrities, like, real celebrities, right? Like, a famous singer. If you're sending them a, an invite to your wedding, you're still sending it to a P.O. box. Like, <laughs> I'm pretty sure whoever opens their P.O. box will know that, like, if, if it was an actually a person who knew them, it would be sent and, like, addressed to their real address, right? And not to, like, <laughs> their fan mail address, you know? Like, ta Taylor Swift, for example. But I don't know, I'm not Taylor Swift. Does she even have a P.O. box that you can send her things to? I doubt it. I doubt it. <laughs> um, 
but I don't know. It's really interesting to think about that kind of thing, though. Okay, I need to have you do something. Came from dance room to check on me? Thank you. I'm doing great. Is there no food in the fridge? <gasps> Uh-oh. Just empty plates? Maybe I'll order a pizza. <laughs> that sounds fun to me. Um, how about a sweet corn pizza? <laughs> um... Anyway, my cousin's getting married next month. Very exciting stuff. Um, at the end of September, big moment. Um, <laughs> yeah, I kind of forget you can order pizza too. I don't do it very often. Um, but <laughs> is Dan not doing so great in his game? Really? Um, but yeah, I, what was I saying? Oh, the pizza. I forget you can order pizza. I kind of just like forget that you can order food in The Sims. I just don't bother with it very often. But, um, can you send an invite to Mickey Mouse and Minnie? Maybe. I know, like, um, with some of that kind of thing, like, like the president and like the queen, if you send them a letter, they'll, their staff will send you a letter back. Um, they won't send you like a gift, but they'll send you a letter back, like from the queen. Um, I wonder if Mickey Mouse will send you a letter back. I wouldn't be surprised if Disney had a thing like that. Um, but I don't know much about it. I've never sent a letter to Mickey Mouse, believe it or not. So, <laughs> a cute card they send back? Interesting. Maybe I'll send a letter to Mickey. Did you get eaten by the cow plant? Stop! 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 Oh my god, you're gonna die because of- I have not had- a baby yet <laughs> you have to stop <laughs> oh my goodness oh the pizza's here wait take pizza come on take pizza should i tip him probably oh well let me oh i'm sorry bestie i was gonna pay you but i can't click on you mickey and minnie will send you an autographed picture of them in their wedding outfits Huh. Oh, do you know what? I think I saw this on Rick Astley's website. But, um, I, I think it said that if you send them a letter and an addressed return envelope, they'll mail you back a signed photo of Rick. I could be making that up, but I think it's only if you give them an addressed return envelope that they'll send you back something. <laughs> but I wonder, like, who does that? I wonder who's in charge of Rick Astley's mail. And how often they get mail. I should do that. Let me look it up. Maybe I will. Rick Astley official website. For mail, fan mail should be sent to the address below. Please include a self-addressed minimum A5 size envelope with appropriate postage if requesting a signed photo. Photos will not be personalized. Please do not send your own photos or merchandise for signing. Thank you. And his address is Rick Ashley Mail, P.O. Box 7174 in London. <laughs> but yeah, you can send them a address envelope and they'll send you back. <laughs> um, Jiggle and Lady Protego, thank you for the subs, both of you too. That's funny. Yeah, again, I, I'm really curious, like, how many of those they send out. <laughs> like, how many people request those? Genuinely. Rick Astley's British? Yeah, I mean. Um. Okay. I think. I'm gonna set up. Oh my god, she's so pretty. I wanna give them both wedding dresses. Um, so that we're ready if we wanna have the wedding soon. Colors. White. Did noise from London. I don't know if he lives in London. Um, he's got a P.O. box address in London, but um, a lot of times with that kind of thing, like a lot of those big YouTubers, they might like have a P.O. box address in one place and then like the post office will then forward the mail to their house. I don't know if Rick Astley gets his own mail for real, um, 
but like a lot of times you might have a PO box address in London or like in New York City and then that post office will forward the mail to you personally. Um, so he probably doesn't live in London, but he might have the PO box address in London. Does that make sense? Um, Cat Rose, thank you for the tier two 18 months, by the way. I want a smaller dress, like a short dress, I think, but I'm not sure what, what one I want to use. <gasps> That's really pretty. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, hey, Jenna Merles, thank you for the 13 months. Happy birthday. I can sing you a song. <laughs> oh my god the other thing okay so this morning dan and i were like reorganizing my closet in here right this is so weird this was a letter from like 2017 by the way so i don't feel like i'm doxing anybody by saying this but um like doxing dan's brother by saying this but we like i keep all of them all these letters that i've always gotten and a lot of them i put them back in the envelope if i like didn't destroy it when i opened it um and we were looking through some of the old ones from like 2017 and i swear to god somebody sent a letter from like down the street from where dan's brother lives like a, a few houses down <laughs> he didn't live there then like he moved there like last year but isn't that so weird what are the chances of that? <laughs> like, they live, like, right near Dan's brother. Um, but isn't that funny? Really weird small world there. Um, but... <laughs> who knew? Um, and again, I don't- I feel like that's not dangerous to mention because <laughs> it was a long time ago. No one's gonna know who it was. But, um, yeah, they live near Dan's brother, so... <laughs> Um, it made me laugh, though, seeing that. Okay, um, it's one of those things where you, like, saw the address, like, saw the city, and we were like, oh, wait, and then we looked closer, and we were like, wait, <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, my God. Um, it was kind of funny. Okay, I think these two look really nice in these dresses. I'm ready. Um, you're a foreigner in the U.S. and at work you met another guy in your team from your country and you're from the same tiny city? That is weird. What are the odds of both of you moving from the same exact place <laughs> to the same exact place in a different country? That is so cool. Um, <laughs> yeah, almond milk, I know. <laughs> um, okay. I think... Well, I'm wondering... Should we have them get married right now? I know they got engaged today, but like Carson's gonna die. Should we have them get married today? I think so. Let's all just go to the beach or something. Oh, I just built a beach wedding venue. We can go there. Um, that's not it. <laughs> but it will be one second. Let me grab these people. And maybe I should take a bigger group. We should bring Jack. Maybe Holly can come. Trent. Sure. Sure. What happened to the brother? He moved out. He's not dead or anything. <laughs> he moved out. Um, he and his fiance live together now. His fiance is a mermaid. <laughs> Annie, Gwyn, um, thank you for the steps, both you two. Okay. On the tram to the parking lot at Disneyland, you started talking to people who actually lived in your apartment building. Were you like on vacation? Have you had you traveled from far away? And the people happened to live like near you at home and you both were on vacation? That's weird when that kind of thing happens, isn't it? That's like major small world. <laughs> um, okay, let me get my Sims dressed here. I came for the sunset. It's going to be beautiful. Okay. Um, change outfit. I told a story before, but one time, um, I was in London. Dan and I were at, uh, Victoria train station in London. And we were like about to go back to our hotel. And I walked past someone that I have known since kindergarten. He was in the train station buying train tickets <laughs> and we were walking past and I was like, 
<laughs> wait, <laughs> wait. Um, he. I think I don't. I don't know him really. I just went to school with him forever. I think he was like studying in the UK and like on a student visa. Um, I assume. Um, but what a weird small world. Like for both of us to be there at the same time in a different country, just bizarre. Just bizarre. Um, but, like, I don't, like, know him, know him, but I've known him my whole life, you know? Um, so it's just really weird to, like, run into him there. Um, but it's kind of fun. Okay, everybody's dressed. Um, I would like everyone to come sit together, please. This is very important to me. No, I don't want to hang out with you tonight. Okay, get married. Come on. Hopefully everybody else goes and sits down. Yeah, Enix, don't worry. <laughs> a lot of people ask this in the middle of my stream. I'm like, do you know how streams work? I always raid someone at the end of the stream, Enix. Every day. I have for like three and a half years. Since before they even had raids on Twitch. And people used to just like be like, hey, let's go check out so-and-so stream and spam a link in chat. We always raid people at the end of the stream. I'm not going to raid yet, though, because I'm still streaming. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, Patty, thank you for the five-month resub. Okay. Don't worry, Caddy, I'll go fast so you can pee. Let me just get some screenshots. Isn't the lighting really pretty? Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Stop! She walked right in front of me! Oh, I'm so excited! I love- I'm just trying to get screenshots, I'm sorry. I know this is dumb and a waste of time, but... Yay! Okay. Look how pretty the lighting looks. Also, Patty, Frona, thank you both for the resubs. Annie as well. Thank you, thank you, thank you, everybody. Um, I like this sunset. That is really pretty, in my opinion. Um, now what? Oh, here! Here's what! Fill the fountain! Serve the food! Let's have a party! Ew! Wait. Oh, it's caramel. Okay. <laughs> I forgot what I picked. I wasn't expecting it to be so yellow. That really, that really threw me off. Um. Well. <laughs> okay, let's, everybody, grab a serving, shall we? Amanda, thank you for the six-month resub. You put your bathing suit on at the wedding? And it's white? Um, that's our, our new sister-in-law. That's our brother's fiance. Look at them all sitting. That's so cute. <laughs> I love this. I take a random screenshot. Okay, well. There are tables, you know. I did set. I think wearing white and wearing a bikini cancel each other out so she's fine. Yeah, that's how that works. Um, it's inappropriate to wear white and to wear a bikini to someone else's wedding. However, if you wear a white bikini, then it's okay. Polly the Veggie just ate sausage. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I feel bad. Wait, I'm sorry. I feel like I ruined her wedding by doing that. Yeah, I built this wedding venue. I made a video building this. I posted it on my YouTube channel if you want to watch it. I, I built this last week, so. Um. You, I'm sorry. You seem fine, though. <laughs> Let's go home. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay, well. Well, 
I'm just gonna go back now. <sighs> Sorry, I didn't mean to yawn. Yeah, I did, in fact, give a vegetarian meat on her wedding day. Yeah. I just heard Dan scream, get out of the way! <laughs> He's playing Dead by Daylight. Sometimes, I can't usually hear him, but sometimes, sometimes, um, clearly in very exciting Dead by Daylight moments, I can hear him. <laughs> okay, um... I think, really fast, I might go set it- so we're gonna have them have biological children. Um, and I wanna set it so that one of them can get the other pregnant, just so that we can have the biological babies. I think... I think I want Jackie to carry the babies, because then she won't die as fast. Thoughts on that? <laughs> I agree. <laughs> Good plan. <laughs> because aging pauses when Sims are pregnant, so then the air won't die as fast this time. Um, works out for me. <laughs> Cher, thank you for the two month reset. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Um, is that how it works in real life? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I heard. Um, okay. Well, don't have a baby yet, but you can go woohoo. That sounds like a nice time. <laughs> I don't want to have a baby yet, no. Um, so that's a Gerald. Oh, too soon. <laughs> Yikes. Okay, well, you know, it this method only works if you don't have cow plants. Um... Because sometimes, Sims face an untimely death. <laughs> oh, okay, anyway. Do you wanna take a shower? You were at the beach, you probably have sand all over you. Even if you try not to be a sandy, you still have sand all over you. <laughs> Thanks, bread roll, it's good to have you here. Um, <laughs> um, yes, Kayla, actually. <laughs> I'll tell you about it in like a week. <laughs> I just, <laughs> I just want a second, um, before I have to post anything on Instagram, you know. Anyway, <laughs> Madame Pelodrome, Jill, thank you for the subs. Um, 21 months, Madame Pelodrome, and Jill with its 17 months. Thank you so much. Why did you go to sleep? You can work on your fun or something if you want to. Channel surf? He's gonna die tomorrow, so. The least you can do is watch some TV this evening. It'll be lovely. Okay, I should have Holly move out soon, too. Um, I'm not really sure when yet. But eventually, I would like to get rid of her so that I have more space in my household. <laughs> Neve, thank you for the 13 month resub, too. Okay, everyone sleep. Peace and quiet until the ghosts spawn. Okay. Do we already have a. Why are you here? Leave! Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. <laughs> Stop mourning these people. Oh, and the Pots Legacy is one that we've been playing on Twitch for a few months here. Don't worry about it. Carson Pots long life is coming to an end. Oh god. <laughs> oh god. It's always sad when a legacy heir dies. Carson's the Gen 5 heir. You don't really need to worry about it too much if you haven't seen the previous parts of this or anything. Um, because we literally just started the new Gen 6. Jackie and her- her wife got married today. Um, I almost said girlfriend, but they're married. <laughs> um, but they got married today, so like, you haven't missed much of this generation yet. So don't worry about the past ones. Um, Beast Char, thank you. Shelby, all of the subs too, thank you so much. Um, well... You just 
Wait. No, I don't want to build a graveyard because I think it's funny having them all in the front yard, too. It really amuses me um, because people in chat are like, oh my god, what are all those graves? And I'm like, what? Oh, my family? <laughs> and I really like it. It, it gives me a lot of joy, um, so I don't want to get rid of them. Why have a graveyard when you can have a yard with graves? Exactly. My goal is to fill up the entire front yard with them. All the way through, you know? Anyway, the front yard is the graveyard. So, <laughs> okay. You, my friend, have work today. You need to work on your writing skill, though. This is very important to me. Um, you are also going to your gig at 8 a.m., so we need to make sure you're all set up and ready for it. Do you want to use the bathroom? Thank you. Do you want to get some leftovers? Who is the alien? We've had two aliens. Um, my, one of the uncles, like, not the heir, but, like, one of the heir's brothers had an alien wife once and then they had an alien kid together and we raised the alien cousin because the alien parents were dead um anyway <laughs> i also killed two vampires um on purpose and such so that that was all no i'm gonna go with polly for her first day of work at the very least um wait what did i just do did I put it in the fridge? I didn't mean to. Anyway, I'm going to go with Polly to work this morning, at least. Um, and then we will, I don't know, leave her be other times. <laughs> but it's the first one, so we'll, we should go with her to her first day of the interior design career, I, I assume, right? Um, yeah, we're trying to get to 10 generations of this one. Um, okay. Starts at 9 a.m.? Oh, I thought I started at 8 a.m. Oh, I have lots of time now. Oh, well, now I'll just sit and wait, I guess. <sighs> what? Oh, you are writing your book. I just, I put her on the other computer and she came to this one? Hope, I, um, I really like Dream Home Decorator. Hope asks if she should still get Dream Home Decorator if she doesn't care much for the career, just for the build buy stuff. Um, I really like Dream Home Decorator. In my opinion, the furniture is probably some of the best in the entire game, and there's so much of it. Like, you get stuff for literally every room, um, which is really cool. So, personally, I would very much recommend this pack. Like, the two kitchen sets and stuff, like, the cast is really good. It's a it's a really nice combination there. Um, okay. Show portfolio. Ask to see inspirations. Discuss decor trends. I may, um, get to know this sim as well. <laughs> um, this is just a room renovation. So we have some, like, free reign here. Um, likes video gaming, okay. Likes singing. Alright, that's relatively unhelpful. Ask about favorite color, show portfolio again. Maybe don't show her anything else, let's ask him. I don't know. Yeah, the career is kind of buggy is the problem. Okay, likes the color black, that's good to know. If it doesn't tell us, we can at least, um, base it off of that. Okay, blue. Okay. I'm gonna go knock on the door so I can renovate. No, Polly's not an elder. She just has blonde hair. <laughs> um, okay. Oh, there's food on the table. That's lovely. All right, I'm gonna send the clients away and then I'll take the photos. All right, they're both gone. What room should I do? Do you wanna do a bathroom renovation? And give them like, no, they like singing and video games. I feel like the bathroom's not the best idea then. I 
I haven't done the bathroom ever. I'm gonna do the bathroom. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do the bathroom. <laughs> um, okay. There's one angle. We could turn it into an office. No, I'm gonna, um, I'm just gonna do a bathroom and make it blue. And I'll put a video game console in it. It'll be great. <laughs> okay. Should I make it horrible? What are our thoughts on that? Just an idea. See, I think this has some serious potential. Personally, I really like it. So, um, this like singing business is really not useful for me. I'm not gonna lie, but that's okay. I filter by everything blue. That was a bad idea. Um, no. <laughs> Let me just look at the blue curtains. Wow. That's... Maybe we do it like that. I think that could be nice. I don't know if there's a blue shower. Let's find out. Oh my god, there's plenty. Okay. That is the wrong color blue. <laughs> That counts as blue. Oh, wait. Oh, there's, oh, good. There's teal in it. No, I don't like it. Let's get a better light. Something possibly uglier? I don't know. Like that one. Just amazing. Yeah, I really like it. Perhaps we could change the swatch on this to be blue. I don't know, just an idea. <laughs> the outside wall, oh. Oh. Top three must packs, oh God. Um, I always say seasons and I really stand by that at all times. I think seasons is one of the best packs for The Sims 4. Um, but I think otherwise, I really do mean this, I really think it depends on how you play. Um, like, I think, um, there was a lot of good packs for The Sims 4, and, um, depending on, like, what you're interested in, others are better, you know? Like, I don't know, maybe you really like building, and Dream Home Decorator could be super right up your alley, or maybe you hate building, you know, and you want something that's more gameplay-focused. I, I... <laughs> um, but always. Seasons. Always seasons. Ashley, thank you for the 10 months. Sid and Razzle with the gifted subs. Lainey, uh, Nico, Pern, Razzle, Sylvia, Shannon, Shelby. Thank you all for the subs and stuff. Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Sorry, someone was just in chat trying to promote themselves. They started adding people, trying to tell them to check out their stream. Um, Bestie, I, I'm gonna give you a word of wisdom if you're still in the stream. Um, that is not a good way to grow your Twitch channel. In fact, that's a good way to make people not like you. Um, trying to take advantage of other people's streams uh, to grow your channel is not really cool. Um, it's actually kind of frowned upon. So, um, <laughs> okay. Um, I think that's horrible. I think I like it. I think I successfully ruined their room. Let me take some after photos here quickly. I think any gaming decor? No. No, it didn't say they liked black. It just told me that she, like I asked her personally what her favorite color was and she said she liked black, but it didn't like say I had to include any black. 
I mean, I can put some gaming in there and some singing. I don't mind. Oh, this counts as as video gaming? Oh, well, I'll put that in there for sure. That's really easy. And maybe the guitar can go next to the... Yeah, that seems good to me. Okay. <laughs> there is no way that they won't like this. They simply have to like this. Um, click on that. Call clients a lot. There you go. Um, I think before, before, after, at, wait, backwards. Sorry. Before, after. Before, after, before, after. Sure. Sure. Ashley. Whoa! Two people named Ashley just subscribed in a row. Ashley XOXO with the 10 months and Ashley Williams Music with the sub. Thank you both so much. Um, and Lacey, thank you for the three months too. I really appreciate that, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, okay. Let's show it off. Here we go. I really like how this room seems to fit in with the rest of the house really well. Um, it feels really appropriate and it, it really just matches this lovely cottage vibe, you know? Um. <laughs> yeah. Reveal renovations to client. Do you like it? Anybody, anybody? Come here, check it out. I got some flooring for you. Um, I got this. I got this. I wonder if they'll like it. Oh, Hellcat, that's so exciting. I'll look at it later. Thank you so much for showing it. Um, looks like a little swimming pool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you're ready. Okay. Ask for final verdict. I, I couldn't tell what they thought. It was really unclear to me. Okay. That's fine. It's almost Trent's time! Oh god. <laughs> Queen Mango, thank you for the two months too. Ugh. I think everybody loves it. Well, there you go. <laughs> I'm rich. <laughs> Sarah and Macy, thank you both for the subs. We can just do an occasional one whenever we need money. It'll be great. See? Easy. Easy. I will fix bathrooms all over the world, if that's what it takes. <laughs> okay, how are we doing? Oh, Carson, no! Oh, okay. Not good. We are not doing good. <sighs> okay. We're gonna be okay. We will get through this. Um, I hope. <laughs> so we probably should try for a baby soon as well. I've not really thought this through. Alex, Sasquatch, thank you both for the subs. Thank you so much. Um, oh, Jules, welcome to the stream. Oh, that's a good question. Is MC, um, I swear to god, I almost said MC Command Center. I was gonna say, is MC Command Center over yet? No, is Minecraft Championships over yet? I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> in my mind, MCC means MC Command Center, um, not Minecraft Championships. Who won? Uh, I assume not the Simmers. <laughs> better, no, no, better question. Don't care who won. How bad did we lose?
Dream one, simmers last. Great. <laughs> Glad to hear it. Nice job, Vixella. Killing it again. <laughs> We just can't win, can we? It's not their fault. They did a great job. <laughs> oh, didn't get lost every game though. No, well, that's nice. Yeah, it's just that like all the Minecrafters are, are really jealous of the Simmers, so they had to let them win, um, is what happened. Yeah, yeah. Forgotten companion, thank you for the 40 months. Um, that, yeah, exactly. They just didn't want to make them all feel embarrassed, so they just ch chose to let them win. Um, so that they wouldn't be sad. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna everybody grab. Oh, you don't need to get any food, you're fine. Okay, well, everyone, I made this food for you, so please eat it. Carson's last meal? Stop! <laughs> It's not funny. I've had so many Sims die this week. I'm not comfortable with this. I want it to stop. <laughs> oh, well, you didn't tell me CPK was on Dream's team. That means CPK won. I know CPK. I would consider him a friend. Well, th that means I won. <laughs> See? Okay, well, anyway, Ronald, thank you for the 22 months. Was it a mess this time, Maya? I've actually, truth be told, I've actually never watched MCC. Because usually I stream kind of through it. And I swear to God, every time I do a 12 hour stream, MCC is happening. Because I always do it on Saturdays. And I I swear almost every time they overlap. But like, in my, I'm not trying to pick it based on that. I'm just trying to pick it based on like, what works for me, you know? And they always overlap. So I've never actually watched all of it. I've seen like, parts of it. I watch some of it, like, before I go live sometimes, but, um, a lot of my friends are in it a lot of the time, so that's fun. Um, I am not doing a 12-hour stream today. I mean in the past, Tree Hugger. Um, not today. I can't do a 12-hour stream today. No, 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 no. Okay, take a bath. You aren't gonna get home until seven. I'm scared that your dad's gonna die while he waits. Maybe you'll hang out with the cat before the cat dies. This is all very important. <laughs> oh, Canadian Hufflepuff, Starfire, thank you both for the subs too. Um, well, look, we're doing our best and that's all that matters. Sorry, <laughs> I just saw someone got banned for a... Sometimes, like, we don't usually get that many, like, scary, um, sexual comments in my chat. <laughs> but sometimes they, sometimes I... It's just baffling, the kind of things people say. <laughs> Sylvia, thank you for the prime sub. You never see them because they get picked up by auto mods, so don't worry. Um, nothing for you to see, but... Um, ick. Ick. Okay, discuss interests. Brighten day. Don't argue about politics with your new daughter-in-law. That's not a good idea. <laughs> um, this fireplace is from the Cottage Living Pack. Um, that one is new-ish. The basement has some, um, gym equipment in it. So... Yeah, I'm sorry, Samantha. It's one of those things, I hate to say it, but you do kind of get used to it, um, which helps. Like, it, does, it doesn't bother me. Like, it doesn't, like, make me upset to read those things. A lot of times it makes me laugh because they're usually kind of funny. Um, but sometimes it's, like, shocking. It's like, I can't believe somebody said that. <laughs> oh, my God. Um, but it doesn't usually, like, upset me, um, that kind of stuff. They mostly just entertain. So, I don't know. Um... Please don't eat it. Please, please, no. Don't, don't feed. Okay. Yes, this is the cottage living floor, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Mrs. Snap, um, 
Sylvia, thank you for the subs, both you too. Oh, sorry, no, it's gone. <laughs> um, Saudi gotten used to it. Well, James, um, that, that's, um, I hate to say it, but it is kind of a thing on the internet you sort of have to get used to. Um, which is unfortunate, but true. <laughs> um, I don't know. I been around the block a little bit. I think... Please stop, please stop, please stop. Uh, this couch is actually from uh, Paranormal, not Dream Home Decorator. Okay, I'm gonna have my Sims try for a baby. I want a baby. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Give me a baby. So we'll have twins. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? Um, okay. Oh, Kate, I'm so sorry to hear that. That's really scary. Don't say triplets! Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> Every single one of you, you shut your mouth right now. <laughs> I want you to apologize for suggesting triplets immediately. Not funny. Oh, we're not pregnant. Try again. Okay, hope, good idea. <laughs> we haven't had triplets yet in this save. We've had twins a couple times, but we haven't had triplets yet. Um, I think I'd like to have maybe three kids in this generation. I don't know. Let me look at the family tree quickly because, um, I don't know. Maybe we'll have three. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Exactly. Triplets. Okay. <laughs> we actually have six Sims in our household, so we can't have triplets. Sorry to tell you, it's impossible. What did, did you just like hack somebody? No, will you stop mourning things? I'm serious. You're making me upset. I might move Holly out. I'm over it. I'm done. I'm I don't want it anymore. <laughs> I'm going to move Holly out. Um, Sims can have triplets naturally, Finn. It is just really, really, um, unlikely. You can also use, like, um, what's it called? Like, the on-lay line lot trait and stuff, uh, the fertility treatment thingy, um, the point reward, all to get extra luck for having it. Um, now there's room for the triplets! Oh, okay. <laughs> Um, these people are our family. Maybe I'll move that. Maybe, maybe I'll move her in there. There you go. No, Sims cannot have quadruplets naturally. You can do it with mods, but they'll never have quadruplets. You can have twins or triplets, but you'll never have. You'll never have four. Um. Bye, Holly. At least you won't be there for your dad's death. Oh no. <laughs> When you say it like that. Okay. All right. Carson's gonna die. Literally any second. Do you wanna take a bath? <gasps> no! Ah! What? I didn't know my god! <laughs> the timing of that is scary. Oh my god. I didn't mean like I didn't mean like literally any second like now now. I thought he was going to die in the middle of the night. I did not mean to. I feel like I just called it and I feel like I summoned it. I don't like this at all. <laughs> I don't like this at all. <laughs> Oh no, no, not Carson. He's gonna miss his first grand 
child being born. You know what? At least he found out that Jackie was pregnant. At least he knows. This is a bad day. Bad day. <laughs> oh, I like manifested it by accident, yeah. I really liked Carson. He was one of my favorite heirs. <sighs> Goodbye, my bestie. At least he didn't die. Like, I mean, like, of something terrible. He died of old age, because not a lot of pots can say that. Actually lived a very long time. So I'll remember. See? Some of these people did not share that same fate. <laughs> so. <laughs> well, um. Do you want to take a bath? <laughs> I can't believe I like called it like that. I'm so sad. That was not my intention. Now he won't see the triplets. Stop. It's not possible. I don't think. I don't want to check because I want to be surprised. But I don't. It's not possible because she got pregnant when there wasn't enough slots in the house. Yeah, this household was a lot bigger at the start of the stream because we had two siblings move out and one of the parents died. So <laughs> the household is slowly getting slower. Oh, and now Trent's ex-husband is dead. <laughs> Do you know, it's a real shame because while Carson was very mean and broke Trent's heart and then married Trent's stepdad, they were really good friends after all of that, you know, even after the divorce. Um, I'm sorry, Trent. I am sorry. Well, it's been fun. <laughs> Let's go to bed. <laughs> I want the baby. I'm excited about this. Off to sleep. Please, no ghosts. Please, I'm not ready. I don't want any. Not right now. I've had a rough day. I do not want to see you, Clayla. Clayla was the guy who just died's mom. So. Well. We're gonna have ghosts anyway. It's fine. Just ignore it. <laughs> Annie Ross, thank you for the bits again. It won't be twins. It won't be twins. I promise. Um, and you're right, the toilet is broken, but I feel like I shouldn't replace it. I should have them repair it. So I'm going to wait until the morning. <sighs> Just ignore the ghosts. It's fine. Yeah, you can have ghosts in the base game, Lil. Ghosts are base game. The paranormal pack doesn't really affect the ghosts like this. Um, those are different ghosts. These are ghosts of like, because I have all these graves on my lot. These are the ghosts of people that are in these graves. That's base game. Um, Trent, would you mind going back to sleep for me? Or you could, well, you could use the booby-trapped toilet and then go to sleep. Oh. Morning from losing someone. I'm sorry. Is paranormal worth bundling or nifty knitting? Ooh, I think I really like the furniture from the paranormal pack. Um, but I think I like the gameplay of Nifty Knitting better. The graveyard's a different save, Pico. The, that's a different legacy challenge save. Um, this is my graveyard, and I like it. Can I check when Trent's gonna die? I don't want to. <laughs> It's gonna be soon, and I don't want to. Oh, 146 simoleons. Thank you very much. Okay, do you wanna take a shower? Do you have work today? No, we're both off work today. Oh, fun! Do you wanna go to the spa? We 
we are all like 95% certain they're going to be updating Spot Day in the next couple of weeks here. So maybe we could get one last hurrah with Spot Day before they change it. I don't know. They're not going to change it a lot. I don't know what to expect, but we could at least put a spa down for fun. Lots. Lot type. Spa. Um, perfect balance spa. Seems good to me. Vanilla, they're going to update a game pack that sounds like probably is going to be Spa Day. I don't know more than that. <laughs> um, I don't know more than that. Yeah, Hope, I was messaging Hope earlier. Hope, um, had to do some, like, dental surgery today. Um, and so I was talking to Hope earlier when she had, like, just woken up from anesthesia. Hope said two really weird things to me. Um, what was the joke that you said? The Sims 4 Spa Day. Hold your horses free update. Wash your horses in brand new stalls. Choose hairdos for your horse. Horses sold separately in the Sims 4 Horse and Around gameplay kit. It was funny. The other weird things she said were just very bizarre typos. Um, let me, can I show you one of them and can you all guess what it says? That's a fun game, actually. Okay, hang on. Let me just... Nope, wait, Comic Sans, please? What do you think that means? Um, that says weird schedule. I told Hope that I had a weird schedule last week, to which she replied, I have whatever that says too. <laughs> um, so that made me laugh a lot. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> uh, I'm not making fun of, fun of you, Hope, though. Um, it's not your fault. You just woke up from anesthesia, so. <laughs> Doesn't she do your closed captions? <laughs> yeah, the person who typed this is the one who does my closed captions on YouTube, yes. Yes. Indeed, actually. Um, the person who typed this is the one who types out my closed captions on YouTube. Very qualified, yeah. <laughs> I should name the kid that? I'm not gonna make fun of Hope. That's mean. I did that to Owen a bunch of times and I feel bad, so I, I can't do it to Hope too. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna, um, who are you? That's me. No, I'm coming here with Polly and Jackie, please. We're going on a honeymoon. Madison literally said there were typos in it because I couldn't read it back, so I asked her to, and she said, don't send that, I'll fix it. <laughs> Wait. But you said it anyway because you thought it was urgent. Hope oh, that's really cute. I'm glad. Um, I'm glad to hear it. It's a residential lot. Oh, did I not change it? Why did it not by default switch to a spa? That's weird. I've downloaded it as a spa. Okay. Well, now there's nobody here. Perhaps we can go hang out in the sauna. Wait, why does that say try for baby? We're pregnant already. They're going to woohoo in the sauna. This is wildly inappropriate. <laughs> Thank you for the bits. <laughs> um, okay. Devils, 
I, um, I didn't take a pregnancy test? Yeah, I did. Didn't? I thought... I did. Maybe I didn't? Oh. Oh. Well, I thought I did. I'm confused. I swear it said I was pregnant. What?! It's, I think that's because of the risky woohoo. I think the pregnancy glitched and she was pregnant because I swear I took a pregnancy test. Either way, um, she is not pregnant, but I'm doing a fertility massage, so I will be pregnant. Mark my words. This fertility massage business was probably a bad idea. Um, but it'll be fun! Okay, I don't mean to be weird, but, um, you guys are in my sauna, and I need it. So... I'm going to try for a baby now. Thank you. Come on. Come on. I don't want to get lunch, I want to have a baby. Duh. <laughs> See, Rich, thank you for the six months. Don't. I don't want to talk about triplets because I- We just did the fertility massage, so it's actually like a very real possibility that she might have triplets because of the fertility massage. But please, please don't joke about this. It's too soon. I'm sorry, is that a- Glass door directly into the bathroom. Jackie is not pregnant? Okay, this place is cursed. First, they have glass doors into the toilets. That is an EA build, yeah. That's one of the ones they added to your library when Spot Day came out. Um. Well. I would literally rather pee myself than use a glass bathroom stall. No, I am very much with you on that. 100% on the same page. You come- repair the toilet. You know what? Repair the toilet. This is fine. This is fine. No, I'm not gonna use the ley line lot trait. Don't- don't play any games with me. Trent's long life is coming to an end! Oh god. Okay, here. No, oh, wrong sim. Take a pregnancy test again. Oh, it's an MC Command Center bug. Same sex pregnancies don't work with MC Command Center installed right now? Let's try that. That bug has been around forever? But how? Because I literally... I- my last- <laughs> Let's see. The last error in this save, the last error in my YouTube challenge, I've had- I- like, only same-sex pregnancies for the past while. That's so weird. Is it just... women? Because... Like, Trent didn't have that problem. Yeah, maybe it's just female sims that are having that problem. That's a weird glitch. That's a very weird glitch. Um. Yeah, I don't know why that is. Okay, well, let's try again. I disabled mods. Let's see if it works this time. 
Well, yeah, Skyla and Belle had babies, but that was a long time ago. That was a few months ago, Caddy, so that, like, maybe the glitch happened after that. I don't know. Um. I guess we'll see. Um. Yeah, that's bizarre. I don't know why that's happening. We test. It also, like, it might not be happening in your game, and if it's just, a, if it's just the mod causing it, that's, um, the mod's fault. Um, so, let's find out. Little Laggy Rafiki, thank you both for the subs. 12 months, Rafiki, and 11 months, Little Laggy, thank you both so much. Um, mm -hmm. it might just be anybody, Quinlan. It's interesting, I don't know. I guess we'll see. I haven't had a pregnancy glitch yet. This is the first time I've experienced this. Um, but. Let us try again. Oh, the cat is sick now. Everything's going wrong. Okay, let's find out if it worked. Twas the mod. <laughs> I don't know. That's really weird. Okay, well, to the mod out and it fixed it. So, I suppose I'll just leave the mod out for a while. I don't know. <laughs> Do you want to take a, a rose petal bath, perhaps? No, Ellie, you can have kids as a same-sex couple without mods. Um, you can just change it so one of the Sims can get the other pregnant and cast. That's, that's built in with the Sims 4. Um, yeah, that's really weird, Hope. I'm really, I don't, I don't know what's happening. Has anybody reported that to MC Command Center? Do they know that's happening? Like, I mean, like, an official report, not just, because it sounds like a lot of us know this, but, um, the way that bugs get fixed is, like, through official channels, um, but maybe we didn't realize it was MC Command Center until now. They probably know. I mean, like, everybody uses it, but, um... My portrait CC? Don't worry, Isabella, I don't care that much about the portrait CC, it's fine. It's gone now, but it doesn't matter. I knew it was going to be gone. I did it on purpose. Um, anyway, weird, bizarre, but it's fine, we fixed it, she's pregnant, so. <laughs> um, uh, and thank you for the six months, Desi, thank you for the nine months, thank you so much. Um, <laughs> and by myself, thank you for the prime sub, too. Well, oh, did you get eaten by a cow plant? Oh my god. You are not having a good day. <laughs> you, you are not having a good day. Okay, well, I'm gonna try and take the cat to the vet, I think, because the cat is sick. And I'm out of wellness treats, so we have to go buy some more. Um, okay. That's not a cat. Be nice! Hope. What do you know about cats? Hmm? It's not like you have two of them. <laughs> Are you sure that's a cat? No, it's definitely a cat. I'll show you. I know more I know more about cats than you do, genius. Dan and I made the reference to my sister the other day. Um like Dan said, I know more about American girl dolls than you do, genius. And Shannon was like, what? And was like Trying to act like he was weird for saying that. These kids are too young. <laughs> How, they're so, so out of the loop. Anyway, this is my cat. Um, do you like it? To be fair, um, my sister is 16. And when did Vine die? <laughs> Um, disappointing, but not surprising. Okay, I'm gonna buy a bunch more wellness treats, because I used up most of them. So I'll just buy, like, five or ten or whatever of them. Um, and then I will give that treat to you, and then I'll just go straight home. You're 17, you know the vine? Well, don't be mean to my sister. Don't dot 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 me, Alfredo Buns. My sister is a child who is uncultured, yes, but that's not her fault that she doesn't know Vine references. She's not on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> you 
<laughs> yeah, I like ugly pets in The Sims. It's very fun. Um, but anyway. <laughs> no, I know you weren't Alfredo, don't worry. Um, okay. Shanna was busy, like, making Musical.ly's. She's a different era of the internet. I was never on Musical.ly. She was, you know? Like, it's a, it's a different time. Um, you are not the oldest one here. Courtney, not even close. Don't feel like you're old. Guys, let's not talk about age in chat just so that the kids don't say their age if they're underage. I don't want to put them in danger, but um, I promise you're not the oldest person here. And there are a lot of, like, older, don't, don't feel bad. Um, <laughs> uh, but we try to keep age out of chat on purpose because we don't want the little kids to put, not, there's not any little kids, they have to all be over 13 to have an account, but we don't want the kids that are under 18 to like post their age in public, you don't know who's here. Um, so let's just be careful, okay? Um, okay. Um, I think, nope. Can you get off the computer? I need you to come do some writing. Resume writing, never eat your pet turtle. It's about time, we still haven't finished that. I'm taking so long. Okay, maybe you can come make some tofu tacos. <laughs> I need to buy groceries. I don't have any food in my house. I was just, I had this moment of like, oh, maybe I'll make tofu tonight. Oh, I don't have any. <laughs> oh, it's fine. I could go to the store today. Maybe. Do I want to do that? Do I want to go to public after I get off stream? I should, yes. Will I? Good question. <laughs> I don't have much to work with, though. So, <laughs> Richie, thank you for the bits. Kieran, Moya uh, knocked with the bits as well. Happy birthday, knocked. I can sing you a song. And Moya and Kieran, thank you for the subs, both you too. <laughs> Take Dan with me? Well, I'm not gonna go by myself. I would bring him with me, obviously. I have to drive, though. <laughs> do I want to do that is the question. <laughs> do I want to leave the house tonight? Um, okay, I think... Oh, I just put that away. I probably shouldn't have done that. Do you have any hobbies? Baking. Oh, you like to bake? <gasps> oh, make some Rice Krispie treats. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Um, Sarah, Dan won't be able to get a license in the U.S. until he has his green card. Um, which is very annoying. Because <laughs> we don't really know when to expect that. We submitted and mailed off the, um, the application yesterday. Um, which is cool. Um, massive packet nightmare amount of paperwork you would be horrified to see multiple forms in there 30 pages long terrible um anyway <laughs> uh it was a fat pile of papers that we had to mail yesterday but um i think he mm, year year and a half hopefully sooner don't know um not ideal <laughs> Is he gonna want to? I think he's gonna want to get his license. Um, I think uh, maybe not right away, cause driving is scary and driving in a new country is scary. Um, I'm okay with driving. I just don't like it. I'm getting a lot better. I've had some really bad driving anxiety for like years, but I'm definitely getting a lot better. Um, I'm not like sitting here counting down the seconds till Dan gets his license though. Like that's not practical cause it's gonna take so long. Like it's fine, I could do it, it's fine. Um, but anyway, it's a weird timing. But yeah, that's the thing, Bexy. There's a lot, um, a lot to learn. So he'll probably get a permit and have it for a while and drive with my dad a bunch and stuff um, to get used to it and everything. Um, but <laughs> it's gonna be weird. Portobello Crossing. Thank you both for the subs. Thank you so much. Um, you don't want to be a driving coach? I don't feel, um, I don't think that Dan wants to practice with my dad. I think he wants to practice with me. However, I do not feel confident enough in my own abilities to offer any advice to Duck Dan about how to drive. Um, 
I'm not bad at driving. However, considering the fact that I got stuck in a post office parking lot crying yesterday, I'm probably the wrong person for the job. You know? Um... <laughs> so... <laughs> to be fair, it was bad weather. But still, um... <laughs> happens to the best of us. Um, I was also feeling extremely overwhelmed about the massive amount of paperwork I had to figure out and do. I mean, I didn't do it all yesterday. I've been working on it for a while, but... Um, I was feeling really overwhelmed about the paperwork and stuff. So it was just a bad day. And then the weather and then the pe traffic and it just was <sighs> stressful. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> um, okay. I think, can you come back and clean that? Thank you. Do you want to eat? You didn't, oh, you did. Okay. The basement has, um, like, gym equipment purple. That is all. Okay, do you want to go to bed? Why are you trying to get on the bunk bed to sleep? Go to sleep in here. Ick. Yeah, Bumble, Dan's from the UK, so they drive on the, on the left side of the road there. Um. So, it's definitely going to be an adjustment for him to... He, he didn't have his license in the UK, though. Um, but it's it's really hard to explain, if you haven't been through it, how much of a culture shock the driving on the wrong side of the road is. Like, you kind of forget how ingrained it is in your brain. Um, and, like, you know, f from, like, the direction you look first when you're, like, about to cross the road to, like, the seat that the driver is sitting in. Like, your your brain might, like, want to go to the wrong side of the car to get in the passenger seat. Like, it's just because of, like, reflex because you've grown up in a different place. You know, it's really weird. Um, obviously, it's doable. It's just, like, you, f you forget how ingrained it is in your brain and how weird it is when you, like, are in a place that's the opposite because it's very opposite. Um... So, um, anyway, not a big deal, but like I tell a story sometimes, but for example, um, this one time Dan and I were walking to the train station in the UK and, um, a car drove by and I was like, oh my God, there is like a nine-year-old in the driver's seat. Like a nine-year-old was driving that car. And then I was, all this happened in my head very fast. I didn't like say it out loud, but I like did a double take, like, oh my God, that is a nine-year-old at the stoplight. And then I was like, wait. That is the passenger seat here. <laughs> that child is not driving the car. But, like, you just, by reflex, like, you look over and, like, because you're so used to, like, that seat being the driver's seat, you kind of forget for a second, you know? But, anyway. <laughs> um, that kind of thing. Um, obviously, you know I'm in a different place where the roads are different, but, like, it's a reflex, so. Um. <laughs> Allie, thank you for the four-month resub. Thank you so much. Um. Chloe, Tej Plays, Beth, Portobello Mushroom Crossing. Thank you all for the subs and stuff, too. Um. <laughs> all right. Well, if they would just hurry up, that would be great. A relative of yours adjusted well, but did not figure out going the right direction in a roundabout? Oh, no. Did they go the wrong direction? I don't think it'll be that hard to adjust or that hard to learn. Um, it's just weird. Um, but... <laughs> Oh no. Are they okay? Um, no, I've never driven in the UK, Green Spoon. I've never driven in the UK. I couldn't have driven in the UK. Um, I also wouldn't have driven in the UK. The roads there are scary. I don't like it. <laughs> um, I don't even like being in the car. No, that's not true. But I just, I would never drive in the UK. Um, cannot picture myself doing that at any point in time ever. Cat, thank you for the prime stuff. <laughs> oh, okay. Um. Sorry. Replying to Daniel's messages. Moral, <laughs> thank you for the fits too. Can you all, are you awake for real? I didn't really intend for that to happen right now. I gotta start talking about the roads. Um. I don't like roundabouts in general, lovey. There's not a lot of roundabouts around here. Um, there's, like, one roundabout in, like, the older part of town. Um, 
but I don't have a lot of experience driving around roundabouts because there's like one, <laughs> you know? Um, so that the idea of that makes me really nervous. It's not that big of a deal, like usually they're fine. Um, but I don't have a lot of roundabout experience because there's just one here, so. Um, it's kind of, it, it depends where you are in the country. They're a lot more common in different parts of the country. Um, yeah, the scary ones in DC have like seven exits and four lanes. Yeah. Pass. Do not want to drive there. No, thank you. <laughs> Hope I will not be road tripping to your house. I'm sorry. It's not going to happen. Okay. Um, 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 I think, uh, Cameron, we're not going to have any real wedding plans until, um, I mean, the main concern, right, is the fact that there is currently a travel ban and Dan's family could not come at all. <laughs> Obviously, right now it's dangerous to do that anyway, so it's not a thing that's going to happen anytime soon, but, like, there's also the added problem of, like, it is literally impossible for Dan's family to come, so, like, um, a real wedding situation is just not a thing for like a couple years. A couple years. Not even a thing I'm thinking about because um, obviously that is a priority. <laughs> so, um, yeah, the ghosts drown. That's why the floor is wet because the ghosts drown so they drip. See this? She's dripping. I don't have MC Command Center installed. Starfish Spacey, Huffle Sophia, thank you for the subs. Um, thank you so much. Um, yeah, anyway. <laughs> I cannot fix it until you go away. And I can't force you to go away because I had to uninstall MC Command Center because it wouldn't let my Sims get pregnant. <sighs> yeah, once the pregnancy is over, I should really get it back, I think. Um, all right, do you wanna make some mm, pancakes? That could be fun. Um, Oh, yeah, that is stressful, Oro, for sure. Um, this is why you need triplets. <laughs> yeah, if we had triplets, then we wouldn't have to worry about having any more pregnancies. So. That's an option. For sure. <laughs> what are you doing? Stop. Feed. Milk. Play with. Um. So you have to install MC Command Center. It's a mod. Um, I had to uninstall it today because we discovered that there is a weird glitch where MC Command Center seems to be breaking pregnancies. Um, and it seems like, in particular, breaking same-sex pregnancies for some reason. Like, it wouldn't let them get pregnant, and as soon as it took it off, it was fine, and they could they could get pregnant. Ah, no! <gasps> Stop! I'm not prepared for this! I'm talking about glitches! I don't want this to happen right now! No, 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 no! When I started the stream today, I had like seven sims in my household. Two of them died. Two of them left. I just, I... Okay. 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 Um. And then there were two, I guess. <sighs> About to be five. Hope, I swear, if you don't stop this. Mmm. <laughs> It's growing. No, my cat's not making the noises. The, the in-game cat is making those noises. Oh my god, in case that wasn't clear. Um, that is not my real-life cat meowing right now. <laughs> that is the game cat, I swear. No, the game cat is also an elder. Who died? Their other dad, both their dads, or both of this sim's dads have died now. Um, a day apart from each other. This is a bad, bad, bad day. Jancy, Ida, Jay, Mallory, thank you all for the subs and bits too. 
Why did Jackie's last name change? Oh, because of MC Command Center. Ugh. I have to go do it. That The mod does that. It changes their names. <sighs> Let me go put it back to Potts. Potts is our legacy family name. So I, I you can keep your last name, but I don't want um, the legacy name to go away. That's important. Gotta put it back. Um, Damn, I'll get another pet eventually, Cameron. I feel like now is not a good time. <laughs> There's too much going on. Um, <laughs> oh no, Spacey, it was, um, I was really anxious yesterday. It was just a bad day. It was one of those days where like, anxiety to the max, and then there was really bad weather and I had to drive home and it was just really stressful. It's fine. It's fine. Should I show the video again? This is out my window. Kayla, come here. That's the rain. <laughs> anyway, so I didn't stream yesterday <laughs> cause I got home, um, had to walk from my car to the house in that, um, soaking wet, was gonna stream and then I was like, you know what, I'm having a really bad day right now. <laughs> Because <laughs> I just got done crying in the car. Finally got home. Um, no, it wasn't It wasn't raining like that when I drove home. Um, but it got bad very fast. Thank God it wasn't I wouldn't have driven home if it was raining like that. I would have sat in the parking lot and waited it out. I wouldn't have driven in that. Um, <laughs> I'm too scared. Um, but it was, it was raining, but not like that when I went home. Um, yeah, it looks like my house is being sprayed with a hose. No, that's the sky. It's because it was raining so much the gutters just like stopped working. <laughs> it's like I didn't have gutters and it was just flying off the house into the wind. And it was super windy, so it was like flying into the windows. Um, yeah, it was pretty bad. So anyway, I didn't drive in that. Don't worry. <laughs> Don't worry. Hmm. Um, I want to see if her brother's baby was born yet. Oh, it was! Delaney! Oh, do you want to go meet it? I wonder if it's, a, if it's an, uh, a mermaid. I'm gonna go find out. I like the name Delaney. Delaney Lemons? Oh no. Oh no. Okay, let me go check. Where am I going, Sulani? Hello, my friends. Yeah, hope you used to go by Delaney on the internet, yeah. Um, it's kind of fun. I like the name Delaney, I do. It's pretty. I don't like the sim that I used to have, Delaney Lemons. Oh, forgot we don't have any furniture. Okay. Um, <laughs> maybe I should give them a new lot. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Let me go aid to the baby and I'll give him a new. <laughs> oh no, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. Aid to the baby quickly. Angelic. Oh my gosh, you look just like your dad. That's exciting. Are you a mermaid? Bailey, thank you for the 36 months. Um, well, I don't think that Delaney is a mermaid. I'm pretty sure. Wouldn't it show us? Oh well, her mom's a mermaid. <laughs> so, um, okay. No, the unplayed Sims won't die. Obviously they have no furniture and stuff to fix their needs, but the unplayed sims don't actually use those things to fix their needs so they don't actually need them obviously it's not good if they don't have any beds but it's like fine won't show you the scene a teen i don't remember i've heard both i feel like um but we'll see hashtag island living i'm gonna get him a random house if it'll load. No, lots, not rooms. Oh, I misclicked. 
Oh, I misclicked. Okay, lots. Occultism manifests in teenage years. Doesn't it show it when they're a toddler still though? Like they don't actually, they don't actually act like a, a cult until they're a teen, but doesn't it still show the label? I don't know, we'll figure it out. I think it shows in casts as toddlers. Doesn't matter, we're not gonna play with this sim. <laughs> um, okay, come on. Oh my. I want one that's over the water. I don't, this one is over the water. Okay, they can have this one. I need a lot more money, okay. <laughs> this one is from, uh, P-L-N-C-H-25, Plinch maybe? I don't know. Um, pinch, oh, pinch, duh. Okay, <laughs> that's embarrassing. Let me give myself some more money and I'll place this down for them. Furnished. Come on, come on. Oh, that's really nice. Oh, perfect, okay. Well, there's no toddler furniture, but not my problem. You guys will be fine. See you later. <laughs> uh, is that me that you're the four months too? Okay, well, off we go. Try again, back to manage worlds. That is a big upgrade, yeah. <laughs> um, it's fine. Again, not going to, um, not going to play with them, so it doesn't matter. Nice, but too big for them, isn't it? It's fine. I'm not playing with them, it doesn't matter. <laughs> um, okay. I think... Well, then there were two. Where's the cat? You don't think the cat died while I was in the other household, do you? It was an elder? that the cat died. I, the cat was like gonna die. Oh yeah, check relationships tab. Good idea. The toast did die while I was gone? How did you put the urn in my household inventory? <laughs> toast? There's not an urn? I literally went age of the toddler and then came back. All I did was age of the toddler. All I did was age of the toddler and the cat died. I was gone for like two minutes. Yeah. I don't think we're going to have the gravestone. It doesn't usually give it to you. I've never had luck finding it. I, do, I, I think it's gone. Well, I'm gonna get a dog now. <laughs> I, I'm not even gonna have the gravestone. I can't, this is horrible. This is actually horrible. How is this fair? <sighs> oh, look at this one. This one's named Booger. Oh my God, can we get that one? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. 
okay, okay, okay. I'm just gonna get booger. Oh my god, that is really good. I hope booger likes me. <laughs> Goodbye, toast. Hello, booger. Exactly. No, I'm very sad about toast. I need something to bring me joy. This is the only option. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look, 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 look. <gasps> You're so small and cute. Oh my god. Okay, okay. Come here. Do you want to be my- oh, I have to go to work? Oh, fine. Okay, sorry. You can do it. This is the best day of my life. I'm not kidding. Offer friendship. Pet. Talk to. Praise. You're such a good dog! I'm gonna cry. Okay, um... Just adopt. Just adopt. It's fine. Just do it now. Polly just became friends with Booger already. Oh, it's Love Day. Well, that's nice. Well, I'm in a potty train the dog. I'm I'm so happy. I was sad about my cat before, but now I'm over it because I replaced it. <laughs> okay. Well, give treat. Talk to. Hug? I know it can't use stairs, but shouldn't it be able to potty out here? They pee on the porch all the time. I'm gonna give the dog a dog door too. Okay. Ah! I need door. It's gonna be a small dog. So we can just put a small door. Yeah, that'll be fine. <sighs> okay, and then we can get a little doggy bed. I'll put it downstairs for now because Booger can't go upstairs. So you can have that. Um, I don't need a litter box anymore because my cat died. So <laughs> we can get rid of that. Um, we still have a pet bowl. Maybe I will get a little box of toys to put over here or something. I don't know. That'll be nice. Yeah, Rainbow, I really wish that they had, um, a graveyard in The Sims 4, like a proper one, so that you could always collect the graves of, like, the Sims that you wanted. Um, because it's so hard when sims die and then you lose their graves. Like, because I wasn't in this active household when the, when the cat died, I lost the grave. And I don't have it anymore. I don't have my cat's grave. A pseudo grave for toast, like a toaster. Well, we don't have any toasters in The Sims 4, but we could put a pretend grave down. Because toast didn't get one. Maybe I'll make it really small. And then we'll know it's for toast. There. <laughs> yeah, there's no toasters in The Sims 4. Where do the graves disappear to? Um, I think it's to fix, like, lag problems. They choose to not have the graves show up and grave it. Yeah, there you go. Um, anyway, like, think about this, though. Obviously, it's really annoying when sims whose graves you want, you can't get. But think about how many sims are in the world. And think about how many graves there would be if they all stayed. Like, you would show up in a household, and there would be, like, four. And they would just keep, you know... Um, I feel like if they made it so that played households kept them, that would be good, but they haven't done that, so. Alas. <laughs> it 
Dislikes photography. Fine. We'll take a picture of my dog, though. <gasps> Look at you jumping! Oh, you're so good! I'm so excited! Okay. <sighs> this is the best day of my life. I know everybody's dead, but... Booger has gained 21 Simstagram followers. Perhaps we should get some more pictures. Thank you very much. Are you angry with me? No, you, you're not. Okay. Oh, your traits. Loyal, jumpy, and active. Those are good traits. This is the best dog. Miss, thank you for the three month resub too. Thank you so much. Um, I think I would have kept the Grave MC Command Center was still installed. Oh, this is Holly. This is her mom. Do you want to meet my dog? Come on in. Come on in the house. Join us. Share love day spirit. I don't know. Complain about sunny weather. Discuss local fishing spots or something. <laughs> um, well, Starfish, thank you for the sub gift as well. Wait, you brought me a present? A postcard? From Island Paradise? In The Sims 3? That's a really lovely gift. Do I have a... Maybe I'll get a postcard thingy. I miss The Sims 3. Who wants to play Sims 3? I do. I'm gonna put it. Okay. I wish you could pin that and it would stay. Wouldn't that be nice? Well, I can put a picture of the dog on the desk, which I plan on doing. Yeah, that's really cute. Um, yeah, maybe I will play The Sims 3 soon, because I love The Sims 3, um, a lot. So, <laughs> um, I'll figure out my schedule for next week later, and then we'll, we'll see. Um, we do have one sponsored stream next week, and obviously the Stardew stream is on Saturday, and I'm not streaming on Wednesday, but maybe, I don't know, I'll, I'll I'll post it. I'll post it. Um, but I'm not getting off just yet, Hope. Don't worry. I need to... I want to wait until my sim gets home from work. Third trimester in 23 hours. I want the baby faster. Festival of Light has started. Well, do you want to go? No, I shouldn't go without my wife. <laughs> That's mean. Do you want to play? I'll play with you. I have a ball. We'll ask to go potty first, maybe. See if it works. Fall Guys, Hope? Oh, you know how I feel about Fall Guys. Okay, wait. Sorry. I want to... Um, pet care. Mischief. How, can I not play with you because you're a tiny little dog? Give ball to Booger. There you go. You can have it. Um, the doors aren't locked. No. I think he just won't go outside because he won't. He wants to pee on the grass. But I've had dogs pee on my porch so many times, so I don't really understand the problem. Wait, do you want a Sims 3 on the pet again? I'm sorry, this is really important. Now he has a ball. <gasps> it's like bigger than you! I love it here. Okay, I'm gonna have the two of them go on a little date because it is love day. Um, so I would like to make some progress there. Um, but let me... Romance... Oops, I 
clicked off of it. Ask on a date. They want the points, you know? <laughs> Thanks, Nona. I, um, I've been doing my best. <laughs> I know I've missed a couple uploads and my stream schedule has been weird this week, but I swear I have been doing my best. It's been a big week. Um, things will get more normal in the next couple of weeks here, so I promise. I promise. There's a roof over the porch. Oh, that makes sense. Okay, no, you're right. That's probably why. Um, I think you're definitely right there. Um, Well, I'm just gonna... I threw some Love Day confetti. Wait, I didn't mean to click Woohoo and Bush. That was... what? Oh, it's a club cosplay. I was like, what are you doing? Hey, guys, you look like you're having a great time. Yeah, I clicked Woohoo and Bush by accident. <laughs> Fully did not mean to do that, but it happened, so... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Do you want to sit together, perhaps, so I can get the... I want a good date. It's really important to me. Please get flirty. Please get flirty. Does that not count as sitting and talking? Ask baby's due date. Whatever. End the date early. Did you have a good love day? You haven't had a good love day yet? Okay. You want her to have triplets? That's not funny. Don't joke about triplets, okay? I'm serious. <laughs> triplets are not a laughing matter. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna bring them home. Um, I just wanted to get the points from Love Day being successful. In case we need to buy, like, something to get cheaper bills and stuff like that. Um, hope I'll keep going until the babies are born. I'll be speedy. Because I want to know really bad. Actually, I'm with you. <laughs> um, let's go straight to sleep. Come on, everyone. Let's go. Come on. Come on. I said babies. I'm like you. You've tricked me. This isn't fair. No, it's like actually not fair. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. It's still super speeding, even though there's go there's ghosts. Oh my god, it's a miracle. That was amazing. It let me finish all the way through the night. Of course they don't have work today. Oh. Okay, well, we can paint and stuff. So, we are currently in our second trimester. Third trimester in 11 hours. That's a while away. <laughs> Letitia, Starfish, thank you for the subs, both of you. Um, okay, do you want to feed the cow plant, perhaps? Thank you very much. Maybe use the bathroom? Take a bath? Can you get off of that? I can't even get rid of you because I don't have my MC Command Center installed. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, well, we haven't written like anything, so perhaps I should work on that. Maybe that could be my next priority. Yes, I could make them volunteer so I can speed through the day. That is a really good idea. Yeah, I'll have them go volunteer. Okay. She's gonna go upstairs and write. Maybe I'll finish the book and then we can volunteer. French, we had to uninstall MC Command Center because it was causing the pregnancy to glitch. Um, apparently there's a glitch with MC Command Center and same-sex pregnancies. It wouldn't let her get pregnant and when she did, it wouldn't stay. It was bizarre. Um, so we had to uninstall the mod while she's pregnant. I know the dog needs to pee. It's not my fault the puppy won't go down the stairs. What am I gonna do, pick him up and bring him downstairs? I don't care, it can pee in the house for all I care. But fine, I'll do it. And then I'll bring the dog back inside. Pick 
wake up. Oh, you pooped. That's good. You did both. I'm actually impressed with that. Go here. No, pick up, booger. Stop. Pick up. Don't just leave booger down there. Pick up booger. Put booger down inside. Come on. Oh. <sighs> Okay. Okay. I think Hope, personally, I'm very much on the side of Lilac as well. So, just so you know. Let me see about having them go volunteer, actually. How do you... Oh, sorry, didn't mean to yawn. Um... How do you volunteer? Both of us. Walk to fight disease. Just please go so I can speed faster. No, go away. I'm trying to super speed. Oh my god, okay. No, I'm trying to super speed still. Go away! Yeah, these are Dream Home Decorator. The chairs and the table are Dream Home Decorator. Yeah. Did you have a good time volunteering? Okay, good. Do you want to come right again? Because you haven't done it for a while. Come on. Come on. Volunteering comes with parenthood. She won't do it! I'm going to cry. <gasps> Booger's aging up! Oh, you're a lot less cute now. That's okay, still cute. Still cute, booger. You're great. <laughs> it just, puppies in the sims are unbeatable. They're so small. It's so good. Okay, sit. Stay. It's like a dog. Resume writing. Come on. She won't do it, she won't write. I give up. Laura Topaz Logic, thank you for the subs. Okay, well, he can take himself to pee now, so that'll be fun, I guess. Oh, wait, you love dogs, don't you? Well, maybe you could work out today as well. Because it's been a while since you got to do that. And then maybe you, your mom's calling, but maybe you could train the dog. Training. Lie down. Yeah, it might be the laptop causing that problem. I guess we'll see. This will be fun. See, we're doing great. This is great. Everything's fine. The laptop is out of place? No, it's in the right place. You can't place the laptop in the wrong place. It looks like it's not centered, but that's just how the laptop places, unfortunately. Um, it's in the right, in the right spot. Um, I think you would be rather horrified to know um, how weird some of these things place. Like the computers have to place in the center of the desk, um, but like you'd think the laptop would be centered and the mouse would be to the right, but like the whole thing is centered, so it looks like it's off. Does that make sense? Um, Undead, thank you for the prime sub. Okay. I'm proud of you for taking care of your needs, even though you're... Your dad has called and asked you to be his wingman at the romance festival. Um, no. Yes, there's a desk from university where the computers hang off the edge. It's horrible. Absolutely horrible. No, don't eat the trash. Booger. Lecture about eating trash. Don't do that. Not good. Maybe we can play fetch with Booger. See, that's fun. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> um, okay. Which desk? Sky, it's really obvious. It's the desk that like has a little lip. It like a bump in. So like picture if the desk was like missing this part. So the computer hangs off the edge. 
I did feed the cow plant, don't worry. I already did. Okay, she fed the fishies. You can probably go to sleep. This will be good. You can probably use the bathroom. Get some leftovers. What happened to the cat and why is there now a dog? The cat died of old age. And I adopted the dog just a second ago. Official Neopets, thank you for the sub. <laughs> okay, so she is in fact in her third trimester now. So I'm gonna keep going until she has the baby, which will hopefully be very soon because I want it. Achieve level four of the charisma skill. Maybe you could practice your speech for a little bit and then I'll have them go to sleep. Oh, yep, yeah, Polly is in fact sick. You're, you're correct. I will deal with that tomorrow. <laughs> um, thanks, Neopets. I appreciate that. Also, hi, Pyramid. It's good to see you. Um. Um, Ava, I think you will be excited for something in about a week. I don't know how much I'm supposed to say. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, Blake, thank you for the bits. <laughs> um, okay. I think perhaps you can go straight back to bed. Thank you. Instead of peeing your pants. Love you though. Now it won't speed up. Yeah, their username is Neopets. Yeah. Uh, Catherine, thank you for the 16 month resub. All right, come on, give me something good. And by something good, I mean go into labor. Go into labor. Please. How'd she get sick? Um, if you have get to work, your Sims can get sick. Um, okay. <laughs> How many babies? Stop! Do not guess this many. People in chat, 69% of chat guesses there's gonna be triplets. You are all mean. <laughs> you owe me an apology. Oh, thank God she has work today. Okay, that's good. Um, perhaps you, maybe I'll do one of these gigs tomorrow. Um, and I think, oh, take the dog out to pee. Maybe we can go for a jog with the dog. Perhaps. I did do a fertility massage. It's not my fault, it was, the game was glitching. How was I supposed to know it was, <laughs> and we can't even check because I had to uninstall MC Command Center to make it stop glitching. This is not good. Not good at all. Okay, she's gonna use the bathroom again. And then I'm gonna go sit upstairs and try to write again. Hopefully it will work this time. No, it doesn't. Oh my God, I'm gonna freak out. I have this. Did I finish the book? The option's gone now. Oh, it's back. Never mind. That was weird. No, I tried to click sit and then do it. You don't understand. It doesn't work. <laughs> I tried having her sit. I tried. I tried. It doesn't, no matter what, it doesn't work. Um, it might work with a different computer. I thought it was the laptop glitching, but no, it doesn't. Maybe if I write a different book, write a short story. Oh, okay, the book was glitched, but this is better. Uh, Mary, Catherine, thank you for the subs. Blake, thank you for the bits. Oh my God, Ava, thank you for the bits again. And uh, Kyle, could I say hi, Amelia or something? It'll make your friend Amelia's day. Well, hello, Amelia. <laughs> it's a desk, not a table. I guess if, if desks are a problem, but tables aren't, we could try and swap it. That's not a bad idea. 
Oh god, I go to work. Oops, 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 oops. Sorry. Do you need to go potty still? I took you on a jog. Did you not pee when we went outside? Oh. <laughs> yeah, there are so many bugs right now, more so than usual. I, I know I mentioned this earlier, but like, The Sims always is buggy, but I swear right now it's worse than normal. Like, something is going on. <laughs> okay. Um, do you dare me to jump in? I survived. I won't do it again. I just wanted a little, I need a little rush, you know? <laughs> oh, I wanted her to do more baking. We can bake some oatmeal cookies while I try and kill time. You have a problem? What? No! There's nothing wrong with trying to kill your sims, okay? You already had a sim die? No, no, I had two sims die today. Three, if you count the cat. Both my sims' parents died and the cat died. They all died of old age, for the record. Um, but we did have a lot of sims die today. <laughs> So, <laughs> yeah, my bad. <gasps> yes! Come home, come home, come home. Gone into labor, come on, come on, come home, come home, come home. She's still glitched. It looks like she's still at work. Had baby at hospital. Oh, here we go. Okay. Please do not be triplets. It's a girl. Okay. What were we gonna call them? I swear I had a sticky note with names written down. Let me let me check. No, not that sticky note. No. No. I don't have any name ideas, I don't think. Wait, what does this one say? Oh! Ollie, Dolly, Molly, and Lolly. Molly. I'm sorry. It was just one. I'm sorry. <laughs> we can try for a baby again here. Look, I'm sorry. You all wanted triplets. I'll have one more right now. I'm sorry. <laughs> you rigged it? How? I'm streaming. I couldn't have. <laughs> oh, Molly is very hungry. Uh-oh. Okay, you take a pregnancy test. You feed the baby. That's kind of funny. Oh, pregnant again. Oh, good God. That's not good. Oh, she got promoted today, too. That's good. All right. Well, this is going to be interesting. Um, I guess I'll see you all in the next part of it. <laughs> um, someone named Molly. Hey, Molly. I'm glad. Well, maybe the next baby will be Ollie. I don't know. It'll be fun. Um, <laughs> Sammy, thank you for the 40 month resub, by the way. Um, so I will see you all on Monday. Um, we're gonna play some more Sims on Monday, I think. Uh, that is my plan. I think, um, let me pull up Twitch and see who all is live. This has been fun. I really, we, well, aside from like my whole family dying in game, um, it's been great. <laughs> aside from that, it's been just great fun. Um, Okay. I think, oh, I was gonna rate a friend, but it looks like she's rating, so we can't go over there. <laughs> Dang it. Um, I don't know. Maybe we could go say hi to, perhaps, do you know what? My friend Luxie is live. She's playing The Sims, building a haunted house. I am obsessed with Luxie. I think you really like her. Um, let's go over and say hi to Luxie, I think. Um, this will be a fun one. I, I think you'll like, if you don't know Luxie, I think you'll really like her streams and stuff. Um, and like I said, she's building a haunted house, so you can't go wrong there. <laughs> um, I think I will see you all on Monday, like I said. Um, I don't stream on Sunday, so I won't be here tomorrow, but on Monday I'll be back. Um, and I'll post the stream schedule for next week in the Discord tonight or tomorrow. Probably tonight, actually. 
Um, so if you want to the Discord, there's a link in the chat. You can also grab it from the panels, it's always there. Um, Alexis, thank you for the 30-month resub! Um, I'm sorry my sim didn't have triplets. Well, sorry for you, not for me. I'm actually very excited that I did not have more than one baby. Um, but for you, <laughs> sorry. Um, and on that note, I will see you all later. Okay, love you and miss you. Okay, goodbye! <laughs>